um, welcome into another night of us here at Bricks and Minifigs doing our Cyber Fun Day. What is mm-hmm. this? Episode 26 or something? We don't like even that? know. I don't know. There's so many of these. I, I lost it's probably track. like 40. Uh, I lost track. I'm thinking we're in the 20s. And then uh, we just want to do some shout outs. We got uh, Chicken Bricks saying hello. We got Cancelled Car uh, in here. We got Liam. We've got Alec. Uh, we've got Kurt. Kurt's hanging out. We got Robert. What's up? He says, yo, yo, what up? Uh, are we still in waiting mode? Yes, you are. You're here now, though. Uh, let's see. Here we go. Everyone's, yes, everybody's here. Awesome. Cool. Sweet. All right. Sweet. Hopefully you guys hear us all right. Hopefully you guys see us all right. We appreciate everybody who's joining in. So we have 38? I think it's 39. No, I thought it was 38. Something like that. We got a lot. It's almost 40. Let's say that. 38. That was right. We got 38 awesome lots to show you guys tonight. As you guys know and as you guys don't know, in order for you guys to claim a lot here tonight, for you to take home, for a moment I had to think what I was going to (laughs) say. You, in the comments below, have to claim lot number 1, 2, 75, 32, whatever it is, for what we have here price-wise, etc. We can hold it up to a week. So starting tomorrow, when we open here at 10. 10. No, not, uh, yes, 10. 10. When we open at 10 to when we close next weekend, Sunday night at 5. Correct. Almost at 6. You guys can pay for it, pick it up within that week. Courtesy, of course, if you need us to hold it for you longer, please let us know. We don't mind to do that. But out of courtesy, please pay for it and pick it up within the reasonable week that we have it. Yes, I know that if you need it shipped, you must pay the shipping charges and fees yes. associated. Shipping costs, fees, etc., are included eventually when we get everything sorted for you guys who are looking to get some of this shipped out to you. So shout out to you guys who are getting some stuff soon, and shout out to everybody who's already gotten stuff. Yes, and speaking of getting stuff, what happens when they get something? And that is my next thing. When... Each person or the same person claims a lot tonight. They will get a ticket for our raffle that we will be revealing or pulling the winner for in two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks from from today. And the winner of our raffle for our Cyber Fun Night, you will get $30 from us for you to spend here. As a gift certificate. Gift certificate. (laughs) Yeah, from us. Not cash, not a check, a certificate. From us here at Bricks and Minifigs that says your name, the $30, etc. I'm pointing to my hand, which has nothing in there right now, but still. It's there. It's there. Theoretically, it will be there. So, we hope you guys are excited tonight. Speaking of stuff we have to show you and stuff we're going to do tonight, I also have Freddy back here in the shop. How are you doing, Freddy? What up, Freddy? Uh, I'm back. So, uh, Freddie, we had a good, good episode tonight, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we talked we, about some stuff. About, we had some funny laughs, right? Yeah, David got triggered for making good figures. <laughs> there you go. I didn't make no good figures. I'm just oh, stating yeah. of what Lego is and isn't doing. Oh, and before we get too started, uh, John is posting up here. He's saying congrats on the YouTube partnership program and welcome to the YouTube right. family. Yes. Ryan, you um, to yeah, so we recently just joined up in the partnership program, uh, which means we've had a thou- or 4,000 hours viewed. Um, as well as a thousand subscribers, uh, so we've met that. Um, I don't know if it's on YouTube now or not, but you should actually at least soon be able to send super chats and all that stuff to us as well. Um, if you want to be spotlighted or just kind of donate some money to help us out, um, that will be available hopefully on YouTube as of I think right now, but I could be wrong. I haven't gotten a chance to check it, um, but it is an idea. That's exciting that we can now get super chats and stuff. That's well, it's going to be really helpful when we start interviewing some of our friends from Lego Masters, because I've got some stuff coming up. Doo-doo-doo. So there you go. But yes, thank you, John. You can't see it, but my toes are crossed, too. Yes, and thank you to everybody who's been watching and subscribing to our channel. If not, you should do it now. So we have 39, 38 awesome things to show off tonight. We are excited. It's going to be really awesome. <laughs> Liam, says, Liam says Shekels has returned. Yes, the return <laughs> of Shekels. Slim Shekels is back, baby. Uh, Liam says on my screen, I am able to super chat. So there you go. Boom. Heck yeah. So if you guys ever feel like super chatting, you can always do that and be spotlighted here and we'll absolutely answer it and respond back to it. We will do that for you. Absolutely. No, we get free shekels. 
<laughs> right. Uh, Frank is asking, where is Lou? Lou is probably watching right now. He hasn't uh, said anything. No, Lou is working right now. He just briefly was able to join in on our thing. Yeah. And, uh, and, and Robert says, get the shekels. Yes. Get your shekels. See, I said no more shekels, but then that, they all bring it up. So I guess, I guess, this is listen, a thing now. I guess shekels is a thing as for you guys. As long as Freddie is here, shekels is a thing. Yeah. I don't it's know why, but you guys, you know, the color this keeps changing Freddy, between. When Freddie gets his shirt, we need to make him a name tag that says shekels. Just, this, this, when, when I enter the building, this is no longer cyber fun day. You have to realize that. When, when, I, when I enter the building, a, this is no longer shekels cyber election. fun day. This is shekel show. Okay, that's shekel it. Show. This is Shekel Show starring Slim Shekels, okay? That's <laughs> the, what's happening. The show in which you hopefully give us your shekels. Yeah, okay. If you don't give us our shekels, uh, we're going to be... Then we're shekless. Yeah, we're, we're, we're shekless. Shekel. We're shekless. You, you get no stuff for your shekels, and that makes us disappointed. So, and you can now do super chats with your shekels. Yes, give us our free shekels. So they're super shekels? <laughs> super shekels? Yes, <laughs> super shekels. There you go. All right, so I don't know about you guys, but I say we get started. Again, for those of you who claim things tonight, let us know in the comments below what items you claim and what lot number it is. Make sure the lot number and price is correct when you type it in the comments. Yes, if it is not correct, we can't help you. Yes. And, again, for those of you who are tuning in, for those of you who have tuned in, Sorry. when you post what you claim, the first one we see for that lot number is the first person who gets it. Even though you guys on your end see that you posted it first, we are seeing it differently. So, be quick about what you're claiming and make sure the price and the lot number is accurate so we know who definitely is getting that lot tonight. Yes, because it's basically, it's basically like a contract for us, so you have to have it correct. Um, and I do apologize to those at home. I am seeing that like Dave's complexion and stuff keeps changing. I don't think the camera likes the orange ball. So it keeps changing day from like a palish white to like a dark, story totally, of my life. It's a story of my life. totally tanned out like Jamaican guy over I here. I came into the world pale. I can't tell you anything <laughs> else. <laughs> you need to slap David on an Apple Jacks box. There you go. No, you know what would be really funny? If like two people claim it at the same time and then we just see them go at it and it's like a bidding war. Well, there isn't the same time. It's just whoever shows up first. Yeah, I know, time. I know. First it's a millisecond first ahead. We, we need some entertainment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Fight! All right. Mortal so, Kombat! Right, Sorry. See who gets 90s Without right. further ado, we're going to get started. So, what are you doing I over here? Get over there. Ancient so, see, 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 we're trying to our dominant and look at Christopher. He's supposed to be the one clicking buttons. But you know what, Christopher? Don't worry. I'm going to fire you, well, and I'm going to click the buttons. You push mom and dad's buttons at home, but you won't push the computer buttons? Dang. See, watch what? this. Are you ready for this? Watch this. We're going to watch go to lot number one. Are you guys ready? Let's talk about lot number one, Dave. Boom. Boom there it is. Oh, 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 he took it off. Whoa. He tried to remove it, but I got to it first. <laughs> I got to it first. <laughs> lot number one. Lot What's number else? one is an older, I think, 2019 three in one set. Oh, 2017. Oh, so what? Holy cow. I'm getting older. <laughs> We're all getting older I thought this came out two backwards. years ago. Man. Wow, dang. You don't even have to talk about it. Frank already claimed it. Hey, what? Well, uh, he doesn't even know Frank, Frank, he just, Frank, he just, dude, he just, just to show you, dude, look, look at this. You he get saw a satellite. Space. He saw space and he's you like, get a satellite. Boom. Congrats, Frank. Moving on. Jesus. Next up here. <laughs> all right. Himself, What's that? If this Frank's keeps bankrupt himself. No. Nah. Frank knows what's up. Frank knows. Uh, hold on. Like, Liam, like, says, Liam says if you fire your son, does that mean you're hiring for Cyber Fun Day? Um, technically, we can always hire for Cyber Fun Day because you don't get paid for Cyber Fun Day, do you? Do you get paid for Cyber Fun Day? I wish. <laughs> it's called being a guest star. I am the money. I sell you the ask, products, You okay? either ask us to be here or we ask you to be here. Unless you're a celebrity, there's no payment process. I was, I was invited. I was, I was... Yeah. Well, technically, I was invited the second time. The first time go. I just kind of wandered on. <laughs> All right, who's that line number two? Next up here, this is the inner coastal seaport. Lot number two here. Ain't that now? Listen, <laughs> hop to it, brick boy. What did you do? <laughs> Press the button. All right, talk about the set here. Let's go. All right, so this here is an older <laughs> '90s set. Which is really sweet. Look at this sweet old crane. Yeah. 
So it's got a movable crane here, two different containers, one for a tractor and one for an old style bike. Funny enough, these hooks are actually weighted hooks. So it's an all metal piece that Lego used to do. Wait, Lego metal? Yeah. See, look. Isn't that dangerous for little children? <laughs> Little comes Jimmy with, comes with uh, five, five different minifigs here. Cool little docking bay. A little drive up ramp. This guy, I thought nice. his head was gone. Hold on a second. Oh, no. He was, he was looking sideways, and I was like, dude, somebody erased his face. It's, yeah. it's bad cop. <laughs> it's bad cop. But this does, this, this uh, nice little seaport here, the, the ship does dock. Has a nice little space here. Right, um, you could put a minifig here. Yeah, put some minifigs inside. You've got a couple of cranes. This one's articulated as well, so you can move it and adjust it. Yeah. The top one is also adjustable to a point. So yeah, you can get it's a little and adjustable. Hour. And then it has the crank on side. You can also make some pretty sweet noises. What yes. Else? With, with your mouth. Not with your mouth, set. not yeah. the set, right. Um, and then, uh, of course, that's come with the instructions as well. So we have this today. For one hundred and twenty dollars, including all the bases. It's actually not a bad deal. I mean, like you get a yeah. large variety of stuff right here. Yeah, it's a good old set. Yeah. No, it is. I like well, it. Funny enough, our buddy Joe has like two of these. Yes, he does. We had to help him pack them up. <laughs> we had to help him pack them up, and he displayed them here one time. Yes, he did. Yeah. That's right. We had a whole doc with a murder scene at the end. It was kind of funny. Oh my god. Yeah, we had to like. Yeah, they were they were doing uh, doing deal, some drug whatever. deals and stuff like that. <laughs> Yep, yeah. it's funny. David, children watch the show. I thought yeah, I we was need bad. stuff in the display that adults are gonna get, such as the three guys quitting their job. Shut that up later. But they don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> anyway, next up here is lot number three. This is Lego Bionicle. These are the what you might call it, the Baki. I gotta emphasize the H in there, the Baki. <laughs> Baki. You got, you got a Donald. So we Donald. have both of these characters here, which is. Mordach and Zarek. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to say it that way. So we have both of these here tonight for $10. So you can both of these for $10. 10 bucks. That's pretty sweet. One of them comes with a container and instructions. And 10 bucks, That's pretty sweet. Bucks? I like yep. this because they have the, the whole little shifty with the They the, the figures Yo. themselves, as far as I know, are complete, but they do not have the shootable discs. Yo, which is th why this guy can do discount. the twist. That's epic. They can do the, actually, they can all, that whole uh, series can do the twist. Of course, they have knives for arms, and they'll just cut you in half, but it's pretty I mean, cool anyway. Well, this guy's got pokers. This guy's got hooks. Pokers? Yeah. Obviously. So we're going with pokers? Yeah, the those are pokers. I don't know what the prom. term is. <laughs> I can't go to prom. Cool. A jackhammer? <laughs> he cuts up, his, cuts up his date on the dance floor. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> at, least, at least he gets a date. Yeah, I mean, so he's luckier than me. You can get lot number three here. Ten bucks. Ten bucks. Next That's up here. Do you want to talk about this one, and I'll do this one? Sure, why not? I, 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 we'll I haven't done much. Okay, so you usually will switch. Switch. I get, get the camera. Freddy's back. I get to do This is um, our helicopter pursuit from LEGO City. Uh, as you can see, it says, this has actually a good assortment. It has a boat, so um, you know, I, I, I like the shark print. Nice little speedboat with some teeth on the side. Yep. Yeah, that's pretty nice. cool. Nice. And uh, it actually has room for one figure, which is a pilot. But if you want to put like more, I guess you can. If, even if you like... If you want to take the crowbar out, I'm not going to bother with that. But <laughs> if, if you want to take the crowbar out, you know, you probably have some more standing room. And this helicopter, let me let me put the sheet down really quick. This um has spinning rotors, obviously. I don't think, yeah. Wait, okay. um, it has this. Or, oh my god. Uh, as you don't can get see, nervous, Freddy. I'm trying, I'm trying very hard. There's here. only like 20 people watching. Yeah, it's not like there's like judge. a million or a hundred or yeah. just this 20. Isn't, this isn't a ba uh, Beyonce concert. Okay. I'm not <laughs> uh, we have you're not you're not a single lady. No, I am single though. If anyone actually cares, which you don't. There you go. Uh, um, yep. <laughs> <laughs> you kidding? More reason for her to kick me out of the house. With your fourteen, what do you mean? No, but um, it has uh, a line right here for the cops to uh, come down and arrest your your naughty boys, and uh, you have two banana boats for skis. Shout out to you who uh, didn't tune out after watching my horrendous jokes last week. Uh, <laughs> we have a lot of room inside, actually. There's room for pilots and everything. You have a substantial cockpit with some joysticks right here. Yep. And it's a six-propellered helicopter, so that's a, that's a lot of wind. A little hexcopter. Yeah, and then you have a searchlight for a 
big boy night operations. Yep, and then this one also comes with three minifigures. And an alligator. I actually really and like this. And a gator. Movie. And a gator. Obviously, right. this is a Gator film. done. Oh, my God. Get it? This, gator. This, and this, this, one, this one has the nice eyes on it, too. This is a Florida set. <laughs> the Florida <laughs> set? Yeah. The Florida jungle set. So there is the helicopter pursuit for only 30 bucks. Brought to you by Florida. <laughs> Brought to you by the Florida Everglades. All right. Next up here is lot number five. This here is from Ninjago's season called Skybound. So we have several villains in here from the Skybound crew. And tonight you can get this whole crew here for 35 bucks. What? What? Side note, you get two of the same figure, but they have two different gliders. So, what? I mean, whatever. They could just be twins. Twinsies. Yep. This guy's my favorite. I have this one at home. He's got two different faces. And that guy's name's head. Doubloon, right? I don't know. W, you are correct. This is, Doubloon is one of them, yes. This is one of the, like, the best seasons before it all went downhill. I think um, Rebooted, actually no, starting from Final Battle, Battle Rebooted, rebooted um, uh, uh, Chen's Island, and then um, Moro and Skybound actually were some Skybound? of my favorite seasons. Like oh, this. in refer reference back to the last set, uh, Liam says, Florida man evades police and runs from gator in shark-themed speedboat. <laughs> I mean, I've seen worse. There was one headline that uh, I'm regretting talking about this now because I don't want to say it in front of children, but uh, you were talking about the drug deal on the thing. Well, uh, let's just say it had something to do with the drug dealers and uh, the tractor from that set and this gator. Interesting. Uh, Chicken Break says Clancy, Flintlock, and others. Yes, Flintlock, and it's F L I N T L O C K E. Flintlock, I think, Flintlock. was this one. Flintlock is that one. Yes, yeah. that's correct. Clancy is the this one. Spider Dude. Yep. And then there's actually one guy this in is here. A spider? He's playing the spider. All right, sorry, the snake guy. Um, there's actually one guy who doesn't even have a name, which is um, that one you're on, actually. This guy yep. right here? Yep. He doesn't have a name. And funny enough, if you look him up on Brickley, he's not even part of the Skybound set. He's part of a four yeah. pack. Oh yeah, he, yeah. I yep. know what you're talking so about. So he's, 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 like he's for some reason he's not included in Skybound, even though he totally is. No, because the reason that they did that was because they have a tournament of elements Zane in there. Like yeah, the correct. Yeah, you're right. So you get all eight of these Skybound figures for only thirty five bucks. Oh boy, I know Lego. Uh, Liam says season six was good in my opinion. The last good Ninjago season I watched. So he's going back to level so level number level, 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 number six season six. All right, so this is your. Uh, I'm starting right. Yeah. Okay. This is your. Uh, your okay. <laughs> we already started 20 minutes ago, man. This is oh, all yeah. live now. Okay. This is um our police patrol set. It comes with three police officers. Uh, your crew kind of here. They have um. Safety vests. Like buoys, right? Safety vests. Yeah. Um, in case you uh you fall into the water. And then what I really like about this boat that I'm actually seeing for the first time. Look, if you open these doors, there's an engine down there. Yes, yeah, so there's a whole actual engine bay that closes, so you yeah, can actually yeah, encase can just it up if you want. We've been here once before. It's, um, it's got a nice little winch on the back. Yeah, you can just oh, kind of tilt it up a little bit oh, so yeah. you can see. Just kind of take this off and then. There you go, a nice little winch with a hook in the back. And then uh, a little searchlight back yeah, there. Searchlight, and then um. A little uh, searchlight up front. Yeah, and then uh, what, what would this be? It would kind of be like an anchor hook. Right? Uh, the front, I believe that's what yeah, it is, so, would normally be for. Yes. Yeah, so you would kind of like dock it, and then you would wrap the. Mm-hmm. See, I have a dad. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I have a control panel that opens oh, up yep. in there. Low, lower dock, upper dock, or then, lower yeah, dock, there's, upper deck. Yeah, there's one up here, too. And there's some extra equipment in the back there. Yeah, but... Your, Does your, the boat float? Yes. Whoa. This is a floating boat. Epic. Although uh, Lou figures... says, happy Friday, friends. Sorry I'm late, but happy y'all are doing well. Yeah. And then Kurt said hi. I don't know about well, but we're definitely <laughs> doing. We're doing something, right? Yeah. Um... Your figures have to have some pretty uh, long legs to get up here, though. Yes, they have to jump. <laughs> yeah, they have to. <laughs> you can you can stall a if you wanted to. They have to. Uh, so uh, big jump. yes, yeah, so this police patrol boat could be yours with all three figures, and yes, it does float. You can play with it in the tub or shower or yeah. or a pool or pool, uh, jacuzzi. Pool. Actually, a jacuzzi might be kind of funny because with all the bubbles make it. Oh, like, do you really want that heat on that kind of plastic? As long as it's not 120 degrees, we're okay. Oh no. Yeah, this is outside actually... or in the tub. Tub. This is actually uh, 30 bucks. Because at 125 degrees, Lego starts to melt. Yeah. I, Little known fact. Guys. So girls. don't leave Lego in your car over the summer, no, by no. the way. Especially if you go to Florida. Don't put this in the hot tub. Just don't do it. You know, one Just time it was like 85 on Christmas. That's insane. Do you, That's know, do you know how bad in an area you have to live at where it's hotter in the summer than it is here on Christmas Day? <laughs> like, wait, we didn't say the price for this. We did. It's 30 bucks. Yeah, we did already. Oh. I've, I've, be, I've become mute. Like, 
All right, Dave, what do we got next up here for lot number seven? Lot number seven is... Yes, I'm looking at you. It's a cool little firehouse that somebody was messing with, so I gotta fix the door while I talk about it. Oh, so, yeah, yeah. yep. Boom! This here is an old school firehouse. It's a little bit newer, not too new. This is the fire control center. So while I'm fixing the garage... Oh, wait, there's no wheels in here? What the frick? Yeah, what happened to those? I'm pretty sure there were wheels on this when I took this in. Wheels on the bus. So it needs a little, I a little, little fix and repair here, apparently. Um, but yes, yeah, so this nice little uh, set here comes with four old school firemen. We've got a nice little fire copter here with some fire suppression systems installed on the sides. It's a bit aggressive. We have a nice little uh, garagey, which apparently seems to be falling apart as well. So that, yeah. Somebody messed with us today, apparently. We, we were very busy the last few days, guys. We apologize. We were really busy. Um, that so we thing? have a nice little garage here for the big fire truck, which for somebody parked in the middle. Um, so it's got a nice old school fire truck here, which then you lift that up and the cockpit goes up. And that can get parked inside. I mean, to be honest, like, you can't really complain about it being in any condition that it is. Because, like, it's it's a really old Lego set. So. It is an old Lego set. Um, and Dave's working on the other door. And then, of course, it has a little fire car, which we have to find the wheels for, which probably fell behind it. The wheels on the fire um, truck. No, there's no, literally no, there's no tires of it. So we do okay. have this set here um, with instructions for $70. $70 for the fire control center if you want it. And we are going to fix it for you. So Not don't worry about a that. a bad deal. Actually, All right. I think you could actually use this as a um, classic you know what's nice, too, is it's got, it's got, it has a nice little helipad up there, and then uh, you can't see it around Dave's arm, but it's got okay. a nice little window. That door's yeah. fixed. It kind of looks like a um, very classic, classic Batman uh, okay. backcopter. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's right cool. colors and everything. They, All like, right. made it back when the oh, TV you know, show ended. All right, so why don't we go ahead and number eight. Are you oh, ready for number eight, Freddy? I'm going to go to replacement, so you do that. Here, I do this. So this is... um. Toa Matau and Wenwa. You totally separated this completely. Okay, go ahead. That's, that's right, right? Yeah. All right, yeah. I I, I, I grew up with Bionicle, but not really, because uh, I'm, I'm like 14. So I, 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 I knew when it was around, but I had more hero factor. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to try to not trigger people today, which is physically impossible when I'm on camera. But um, So this is um, Matau, and this is Wenwa right here. I believe uh, this is from the Toa Hortica, right? Correct. Uh, one way, yes. Yeah, and then this one is from... Is this Toa? Uh, yeah, it's mm -hmm. just the normal one. <laughs> and then, um, so this one, actually, I'm going to put my, my sheet down here. This one, actually, uh, this perfectly embodies what m &R Productions was doing when the 501st Battle Pack came out, <coughs> when, he, when he was going to his local Lego store. This is exactly what he looked like. This is footage of his Brickbuster mask. And he was just running to steal some from little children. There we go. <laughs> and then um, we have, uh, we actually have two of these, right? Two of each of these together. So if two people want to claim them, or if you want two of the same character, I don't know. But I mean, I'm not going to judge you. Yes, we have, we have two sets of these. So yeah. you get Matau and Wenwa. So one of, one of these Wenua. sets is um, 20 bucks. And yep. then there's two of them. So, so you have two sets. Buy, if you want to buy both sets, it's 40 bucks. And as far as we know, they are complete both sets. Yep. So for 20 bucks, you can have one or two. Wow. Depends. All right. Well, that's up with lot number nine. All right. The next one is from Lego Minecraft. This is the first Avenger. First Avenger. <laughs> Minecraft Captain America. Confirmed. No, this is the first adventure. And um, this is pretty cool. It has, what is it? This is like a cat, right? Cat. Yeah, that's a cat. Yep. And yep. then, um, I don't know what that is, so I'm going to skip over it. Then you have like a, a, weasel. a bighorn sheep. And then, uh, oh, speaking of weasel, if you haven't checked out the Suicide Squad trailer, do it. It's pretty cool. So this is a current set. Oh, yeah, it is. Um, yeah, it is a current set. Huh. Um, so it is uh, it's brand new. This one should be 100% complete with box and instructions. Yeah, this box um, is in pretty good condition. We've got, a, we've got a few of these. Uh gentleman just didn't want them anymore. And trade it in for something else. Oh, this set uses that new piece too. Yes, the new pieces, the one Very by one by one by two brackets, as I confused Christopher with earlier. Yeah. So you can get this awesome first adventure set here with uh, four minifigures and, of course, the little two animals here. Actually, um, great. Just Dave's oh yeah, Dave's around. got the third one here. Yeah. Um, as well as the nice little mine cart and all that other stuff with the first. By, by the way, are you ready? I don't know if I can do this here. Here, Freddie, hold. Put your finger under yeah. there. Watch oh, yeah. this. Come on. No, right, 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 right in here. Gotta put some pressure right, there. Yeah. Now watch. And 
Uh, I forgot where's that. Where's that? It's right here. No. Oh. I was messing Trigger. with that earlier. Trigger it. Water elevator. <laughs> Would that actually be practical in real life? It does. Well, it does. I mean, technically. Yeah, Minecraft. Physics I mean, if you, if you can swim fast enough, I guess that would be the this thing. This is a uh, fifty-five dollars actually. It has it has a nice mix of you know everything that you need. You have your your animals, technically your tamed animals. So this could be your friend. Uh, you have your 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 food. You have your uh, your weapon because or more food. Shave his tusks off. What those? No, that's not tusks. What the? I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Um, we have your your enemies, and also your food. <laughs> Wait. You're getting confused. It's okay. I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay. So, the, yes, you can get this first adventure set here, all complete for $55. And you also get 55 the, two, uh, the two main characters from Minecraft. Alex and Steve. Yeah. If they're nice yeah. little molded weapons. So. Whatever, dude. <laughs> all right. Moving on to lot number 10. Dave, what do we have? Next up here, lot number 10. This is a, a plane. It's a plane. Uh, let's see. Tyler's asking, sorry if I missed, but are the lots tonight already built? I believe so. I think it's the first time we've ever had uh, pretty much 100% of them built. It's a bird. It's a plane. Oh, well, yeah. It's whatever we say it is tonight. <laughs> so, yes. I believe I believe everything tonight is built. I don't think we have any certified sets tonight. No certified. But we still have a lot of certified sets. There's yeah. a bunch of them still yeah, over there. Yeah, everything here tonight. We actually got a lot of them. We so we started selling a bunch of them today. But we still have a lot of certified sets still available. They're all on the website, correct? And they're all on the are they are all on the website, yes, that is correct. Alright. Back to lot number ten. So this here is a just a red plane, passenger, passenger plane. Yeah. Uh there's no landing gear, so it's a hover plane. It doesn't hover ever land, it just hovers. Oh that's 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 kinda of dark. That's sad. What's it dark? <laughs> Works pretty well. So here's a cockpit here. It's pretty nice. I, I still really like this. I'm not going to explain why that's dark, Dave. A hover plane? <laughs> I'm not going to go there. Okay. Anyway, so you can get this awesome plane, wheelless plane here. Um, it does have the sliding cargo door on the front if I can get it to work here. There it goes. Sliding cargo door. Right, and then you could open it up and oh, look how many passengers you could fit in here. It's a lot of breaking passengers, right? Two, four, six, and this eight, one comes ten. with five minifigures and Bumblebee. <laughs> Transform and the little transport sh transport shuttle uh, cart here. Um, so that's why it's only forty five bucks. The wing the wings by themselves are twenty. Bucks? The wings by themselves are twenty five. You get the, all the rest of this, including all the figs, for only twenty bucks more. Yeah, normally this comes with a big airport and a watchtower, but uh, yeah, somebody. Took yeah, it. normally it's like a hundred and forty dollars set. Yeah. Somebody's like, I don't want a plane. Stupid. I just want an airport and a watchtower. They probably did that for the uh, superhero airport now. I'm being completely honest. I don't know. I'm not gonna judge someone based on what they have. Uh, they Liam's asking what's missing, missing from the plane set. Almost everything but the plane. And parts of the plane. Because it's actually an entire airport, as as Dave was saying. But uh, oh, they but here, to keep if the you want to check your flight, if you want to check your crew, and look right here. Boom. Printed. You can check all the flights. What? Time. What, Wait, Lou? You, you gotta it. be kidding me. There's no way. That's not. A, that's not even right. Lou says on here, and I'm gonna post this up here. Breaking news: I just got a text from some friends in San Diego saying they found Looney Tunes minifigs on the shelves at Walmart. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, the person who leaked video. the person who leaked the information bought it from a retail shop already. Yeah. What? They're apparently six bucks now. They're not even supposed to be out. I think I don't think until like They're June. They're supposed to be out at the end of the month. I mean, or beginning of May. The reason that we found the Captain Marvel set like even out was that somebody bought it at Toys R Us. So yeah. it's not. Completely Isn't it crazy? Ever. That's weird. But that's nuts. But yes, there are. Lego. Lego. Get your brick together. Seriously. Since they're already at Walmart, we have to let everybody know, yes, there are Looney Tunes. Uh, the next CMF line or collectible minifigure series line is going to be Looney Tunes. Which uh, we, we did. Uh, did we ever confirm how many the characters were? Is it 12? Is it 12? Yeah, it's 12. So they're probably going to be boxed just like the video. The no, they're not. They're, in bags. Bags. they're still in bags? Yeah. Interesting. Pig? Pig? Yeah. Pig? Yeah. Uh -huh. No, no, it's... No, dude. Have a pig. <laughs> You're so super fired. Super you need, fired. You need to teach him Looney Tunes, right? So like, I know. They're know. actually watching Tom and Jerry now, at least. So they're getting, right, they're right, getting on the right path. That's closer. a good start. Uh, Kurt says, hi, Ryan. Will you have Looney Tunes fakes for the sale in the store? Yes, hopefully as long as they if, show up. If, if once Lego reveals them officially. I will say, though, that, that more than likely they're going to be blind bags because I don't think no, I can. They are. Yeah, they are no, but I'm saying for us. Oh, yeah. Because uh, I will still try to find a box that we can open up, but they are more than likely going to be blind bags. I'll find a box for you guys. Don't worry about it. Um, but yes, uh, Lou, Lou says they are still five dollars, so four ninety nine. 
Really? Because, uh, oh, so I was probably right one when I said earlier. Somebody that missed the price. I mean, no, he probably got it from, like, Learning Express or something like that. Because they always jack up the price. Yes, they do. Well, Toys R Us did the same thing. Too. All right, so anyway, lot number 10. For 40, was it 45 bucks? 45 bucks. So you want lot number 10 for the plane. Lot number 11. All right, lot right number 11 it. is, uh, 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 I'm, okay. This is a Noah, another tor Toa Hordika Wanua. Oh. So it's the same guy as before. Oh, yeah. We had a third one. And Nuju. Okay, I was looking at But then we also have Nuju, which is the white one. So these are both Toa Hordika this time. And, um, yeah, I, I, I think that these are pretty cool. This guy kind of reminds me of, like, a, uh, uh, Ice Age character. <laughs> it, it does though. Like, and they, they, and they do have the little the uh, they, have, they have the little spinners here, and they do actually come with two. So the other ones are on top of the containers here. One has the coat, the little bionicle coat on it. The other one does not. Yeah, and then you also have this like chopping action, so he can be a, a sushi chef. A sous chef. Yeah, no sushi. A sous a sushi. Su, a su, a su sushi. That's, that's very that's very hard to say. Sushi chef. There you go. I did it. <laughs> so yeah, so you can get both of these Toa Horticas for only twenty dollars with containers and instructions. Yeah, that's so cool. Oh, and look, and you could pull the tab and the little. We already showed that. I already showed that. I just didn't want him to launch it off. That's all. You're trying to, you're you're you're, you're trying to take away my. Freddy catch. No, I'm kidding. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> David, we've already found out that you can't hit water in an ocean. Okay, so. Oh. What? That makes no sense. That makes no sense. You am I no... standing in the ocean or am I standing on the beach? You it got no matter. aim. It would matter. You got no aim. Hey, I got no aim. Aim. We're not talking David, about David. If you were, if you were literally sitting anywhere on the planet, you still couldn't hit it. Like if you, you, you couldn't what? hit the ground if you were standing anywhere. So I'm floating. Am I a genie now? Listen, you can't, you can't make insults without logic. I'm, I'm done. Bye. <laughs> 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 dun, 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 dun. All right, lot number 12, while they're doing that, is one of our older trains here. This is a 1985. 4.5 volt steam train. Steam cargo train, you got it. It's pretty nice, I like this one. Um, so this train's pretty cool. I do know it's missing the reverser, uh, which is a little red plastic piece that goes in the track. Um, this is the stopper, though. This is the brake. Yeah. You also get all these cool. tracks. There's extra so track like a lot in there, there, too. Yes, there's extra track. They can do yeah. extra turns. Three like figures. That. Three so things. one of these is the conductor, one of them's, I, I believe it's supposed to be the forklift dude. I believe it's conductor, forklift dude, and... then and... wouldn't this guy be like the guy that takes your ticket? Yeah. It's like, yeah. give me your shekels. <laughs> Captain, shekels. The shekel collector. Um, so Captain this one's kind of interesting because uh, there is a cargo train, a cargo mail one car. in the back, which is a mail car, yeah. um, with some mail in it, top comes off. You got some cargo here, which is actually the old octane, like oil drums, essentially. See, what I what I think about uh, about this set is really cool and kind of weird, actually, is that it opens like twice full. So you have this, which opens like that, but then you also have doors that open like that. Yeah, because there's actually a seat in there, and then you can also take off the top. Yeah, well, obviously, I mean, it's a Lego set. See, open the door. Uh, you got the kind of strong arm. There you go. See, there's a little seat in there for him to sort the mail. Well, this is Inception. I get to see the screen. Be a, <laughs> and shouldn't then, the mail be sorted one And then on this one, because it is a four and a half volt, you have C batteries, and yes, it is clean. What? Who uses C batteries anymore? Do that. Actually, I don't People think People that like Lego, yeah. David. Uh, Liam's asking, is David secretly a stormtrooper? I don't know where that came from. Yeah. No, because we said he always misses. Oh, he always misses. Nice. Yeah. Yes, you're a stormtrooper. The stormtroopers mess on purpose, because if you go back in Rogue One, they murder everyone. So I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so, and yes. Then, and then we have a spring-loaded forklift, which actually works really well. But nice. not, it's not practical, because if you had an actual spring-loaded thing, it would blow up your mail. So this set with the instructions is normally 190 but tonight only, you get it for 150 So $40 off. Not bad. Yeah. It's if, a nice train. If you claim lot number 12. Lot number 12, it's a really nice train. You get the old track here, so it's a bunch of 2x8 plates with modified clips on them. There's a bunch of flat turns in here, and then flat straights. turn bars. Straights and turns. Straights. Yep. And there's some turns in here and straights with the edging on there, so that way, as the wheels go over, it picks it up. There you it's go. It's pretty nice. All right, moving on to lot number 13. Next up here. Alien Conquest like set, doing it. <laughs> for number 13. I know, I wasn't sure who was going to do it either. No, I'm, I'm so this one's, this one's pretty cool. We, we've had this one here a couple times. This here is all complete. It's got this cool little feature. You can shine the light Ooh. here. Shines on the bottom. Oh. And then what's cool is, you know, Farmer Joe over here, you know, just raking his leaves and everything. Just whoop! It's a magic trick. Where'd he go? 
He got abducted. <laughs> I'm gonna rip his head off, David. But yeah, so it comes with a little alien guy, some uh, alien con or alien conquest, like almost or, space. Or police. you can have alien it. defender unit, and then your Farmer Joe over here, of course, with some little defender station here. Or you can have it go the other way, and Farmer Joe over here could be like Evans, and then just we've got an, uh, Sam E that's joined us. Says I love this set. I like this set with the little alien head. Awesome alien head, Lynch by the way. The alien. So this UFO abduction set could be yours tonight. For what? Twenty bucks? For twenty-five dollars. You were close. Twenty-five bucks. Mm -hmm. And just as a reminder, guys, we're at twenty-four viewers right now. If we do get to fifty viewers, we will dump thirteen gallons of Lego on David's head. What if I just? So like, if you have friends and family that made, need, like, have, have YouTube people, channels, watch it. Funny enough, people don't hate me enough, so that's why we don't get. We don't get. 50 I viewers, don't know. We were close. Dump Lego we were on close. My head. All right, I'm gonna form the David Hate Club. Ouch. Yeah. That that's hurts. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Get out. <laughs> He's number member number one. <laughs> he, gets, he gets he gets the top badge for for a top the fan top badge on Facebook. Badge. I get a participation trophy. Honorary. Uh, Chicken Bricks is asking, is it complete? Yes. As, yeah, as far as no. we know, everything's here. Everything for the Alien Conquest set is complete. Even the pitchfork. You know, Hank's got to have. Yeah, even the pitchfork. I mean, like that's the most important part, obviously. All right, All right. moving on to lot number fourteen. Who's number fourteen? Up here, this is the first of. Three or two this friend slots that we have tonight. <laughs> yeah, I gotta show the. I gotta let the audience know like how many. We had some more stuff to. coming. So this one here from Lego Friends. This is the Heart Lake Horse Show. This is pretty nice. We've had this one a couple times here before. I don't know why the horses are backwards. Chris, you messed up. It's not his first time he's messed up. How'd you forget they were here? So this one's got a nice little uh, horse and saddle area. Um, we've got our two little ponies here. We've got Major and Ruby. My little pony. We've got our nice little uh, trophy stand here for the winners. Uh, we also have some little uh, jumps and stuff here for your ponies, your equestrian trail here. Mm -hmm. And of course, our timer with 23 seconds left on the clock. And I'm sure that 23 means something. If you look in the Lego, there's probably something to do with it. Yeah. Um, That's cool. There's all kinds of different things. I think this comes off here as well. Like, there's, there's a lot here for this. It's pretty sweet. Yep. And then uh, we've got, uh, looks like Aaron Hitchcock, who actually just called earlier to get one of our Easter baskets, has claimed lot number 13. Cool. Nice. So congratulations to Aaron for being the first one on that. It looks like you beat Frank just by a couple seconds there. Right. Um, and speaking of Easter baskets, we just want to let everybody know, I'm going to do a little segue here, that we do still have a handful of our Easter basket make and takes available. Um, that are going to be here. They are already set up in kits, as you can see back there. Those nice colorful containers. Uh, we have these here for $12 each. And we are going to be doing a build event here tomorrow. That is the April 3rd at 3 o'clock. So we have, I think, two each. We got two pink, uh, four blue, and I think five green back there. Um, that's all we have left, guys. So if you guys are looking for a little Easter present or something to do for tomorrow, let us know. Make sure you guys call us tomorrow morning at 10 to clean your kits. All right, we're gonna go back over here. So, but congratulations to Aaron on getting lot number 13. All right, and so again, back to 14. lot Sorry number 14 that. was the Heart Lake Horse Show here for $40. Yes, so this is complete. Complete. With, with instructions. With instructions. And extra parts, unfortunately. Looks like, it looks like the cover, the, the cover of one of the instruction books apparently came off. Yeah, came off. Sarah might be able to find another one. She's got instructions everywhere. Maybe. So there you go. So Heart Lake Horse Show for 40 bucks. Not number 15. What's up? I'll do this one. You do that one. Yeah, sure. Oh, just keep switching. He keeps getting all the bionicle ones. Give him something else. I, I, I don't care. I mean, how about least, Dave? How, least, how much? How about you do the next two? I'll at least I one. get air time. <laughs> right. All right, fair. You know you're on this all the whole, the whole time anyway. Yeah, I know. But like, okay, I, need, make it I sure. need the screen time. I need the recognition. <clears> uh, let's see. Kurt's saying Easter baskets are awesome. We are happy with the two we picked up. Yes, you guys picked them up already. Nice. nice. Uh, Robert, um, if you wanted to claim them now, you can. You just got to pay for them tomorrow. If you guys would like to claim them tonight, we will hold them for you. We only have what? There's about nine uh, left total. Yeah. But yes, if you would like to claim a, an Easter basket tonight, you may claim them. There is no limit on number as long as we have them available. Yeah, I mean, every, everything in the store is up for grabs. Right? That's right. Say it again, Freddie. Everything in the store is up for grabs. That's so right, folks. If you want to grab any... the entire black shelf, there, I'll sell it to you for 45 bucks plus all the well, stuff that's I'm... on it. No, no, this is already sold. It's mine now. You no, the shelf, the, just the it. shelf is oh. forty-five bucks. You don't shelf. get everything out. I want the shelf. This is this is this has been on YouTube. Okay, I want this. It's it has a, been on a, YouTube many a, times. It's a movie used prop. I want <laughs> wow. Then you can put all your stuff on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> don't, I don't think 
I don't think it works that way. Don't oh. step there. I spend the 45 bucks to buy a new shelf. That's what happens. <laughs> anyway. It's 45 bucks plus the money. Well, if we sell the show. friend set, he could go buy a new shelf. <laughs> there you go. Done. All right. Next up here from Legends of Shiva. Okay. Oh, uh, Frank is going to claim a pink and a blue Easter basket. Oh, Robert. Sorry. Robert. 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 My bad. So Sarah's going to grab those for you. I don't know. I just I saw something else. It was a Freudian slip there. So Sarah's got all this. Look at this awesome covers that I made. Look at this with the little Easter bunny. Easter bunny. Yep. A pink and a blue. Boom, boom, boom. There it is. Uh, Jason would also like to claim two Easter baskets, a green and a blue. So Sarah's going to grab a green and a blue, which means I have one pink, two blue, and four green left. There it is. One pink, two blue, and four green. So that's all I have left. So thank you to Robert and Jason for each claiming two. Uh, once again, our build event is tomorrow at 3 o'clock. If you'd like to join us here, masks are required for anybody over um, two years old. Uh, how much are they? They are $12 a piece. $12 each for for the kits this year, or this uh, this month. And we have only, what, seven left. And she's got all those covered for you guys. So congratulations. They will be waiting here for you. She's writing you down there right now. So $12 each for the Easter baskets. All right, Jay, let's get to lot number 15 here. All right, lot number 15 here is from Legends of Chima. This is the Fire and Ice and the final season of Legends of Chima. This here is how we call... Oh, Chris isn't Bonnie's here anymore. Ice Vulture. Hold on. I got to set this up here because Chris left me. Oh. Um, there it is. Bernie's Ice Vulture Glider. Yeah, but what about this one? It's it wasn't... The naked mole, right? I don't know. It wasn't here before. Where's the data? Where's the information for it? Talk. Okay, we're gonna skip that one and come back because apparently nobody did that one right. So we're gonna skip fifteen. Sixteen. What do we got, Dave? Sixteen is from Lego Bionicle. These are the Rockshi, which are pretty cool. So we have these built in the container. Um, I believe everybody here is all complete. Yeah. Yep. Pretty complete. I know you went through a couple. And as a bonus for lot number 16, you get four extra crotta or three extra crotta. Well, there's three in each. For, yeah. So you get 12 extra yeah. crotta plus the three that are included. All right. So you get 12. So that's 15 crotta. I was going to say 15. With three Rakshi. Boom, boom. I know how to count by threes. So okay. <laughs> are you sure? God. God, idiot. Just kidding. 17 <laughs> crotta for 13 shekels. There you go. That's yes, for $30, $30 gets you all three Rakshi. And 12 extra crata. Boom, boom, boom. It's like two bucks per crata, and then you get big boys for Sarah, free. The price is right. The other one's just not on here. Okay. The price is right. Yeah. I'm helping my other boss. Okay. Lot number 17. What do we got over here, Freddy? All right. This is our uh, Kai's Blade Cycle and Fang Fire Truck Ambush. Uh, this is $75 for the two of them. And uh, this gives you, again, a nice blend of stuff. You know, you get this nice little blade cycle here. And uh, David's doing David's doing <laughs> his job. I'm doing David things, okay? David things. David things. Do we, do, we, do we know that that's a good thing, though? You talk and I touch, okay? <laughs> well, then. Wow. All <laughs> right. Now either of us should be touching. And look at this. This is this is the nice thing. You get to... Uh, Get yeah, slap, stand clear. You get to slap your, your brother with this. Or your sister. <laughs> probably not your sister, because they probably cry. It is about a foot long tail. I'm not going to lie. That is a big yeah, car. It's, it's, um, and this set does come with six minifigures. Look, he can, he can wipe his own eye if he's like crying. Or something. Almost pick his teeth yeah. from the meat. Mm -hmm. um, so this one does come with six figures here, as well as one of the um, two, Anaconda. Actually. actually, two. See, so comes with the. But isn't that with our oh, serpentines? Is I guess the whole name for all of them. Yeah, the serpentine staff. So it actually comes with two because this guy has. Yes, two. but he is the expensive one. He's the reason that is so expensive. Well, because yep. I believe he is about thirty or thirty-five bucks by himself. Yes. Yeah. So you're getting a discount on your shekels here. So you're basically getting that, and then that set for the seventy-five bucks. That's not bad. <laughs> and then all the extra stuff. I this do. Is, I, always, cool. I always really like this. The whole like. Bob Little Zane's, Zane's uh, bobsled cycle snowmobile here. Snowmobile cycle. I really like this. Isn't that I, called like a snowmobile in the show? Uh, Zane says, or, uh, Liam says, Zane's bike is the only elemental vehicle I don't have. Well, there you go. For 75 just, bucks, just, you can get it along with all the rest of these. Yeah. 
I really like this one. It's, just, <laughs> it's a cool design. It flows really well. Plus, if you don't and have they, that, then you probably don't have the truck. And even if you did, like, I believe so they cool are more. complete or near complete as well with the instructions. Yeah, as far as I know, these were all complete. I didn't notice anything missing. Uh, the, everything was built Rawr, properly. Look at that. Rawr. You Sorry. can hide your shekels in this guy's mouth. Look there at that. Yeah, he's got a nice big, big old mouth to bite people with. Um, so yes, says lot number 17 for 75 bucks if you want some Ninjago sets. All right, we're going to go back to 15 real quick. It's apparently got fixed. So back to 15, we have Lego Chima. This is Vardy's Ice Vulture, if I said that right. Uh, glider, wait, what? I don't know, what happened to She didn't put an and in between there. Um, that's Vardy's Ice Vulture Glider and Sir Fingar's Sabertooth Walker. What's cool about this is on the back here, you can lower it. There's like a little gear here. And then you get that bike. Does this leg have adjusted suspension? Oh, that. look at that. The bike it comes out of its here. butt. <laughs> yeah. I refuse comes to believe that stomach. wasn't supposed to be a remake of the Zane's Ice Cycle. I don't know, but it's pretty cool. I, I really like this. If this was built more instead of the bike... This would be a really cool kind of like, me of a naked saber tooth type. Yes. Like it a, does look like a naked mole red a little bit, but... What do you mean a little bit? That is a naked mole red. It totally does look like a because of the back. Yeah. And the, um, and the, the face looks like the one from Kim Pops. So we've got this nice little uh, saber tooth walker here and then the glider as well. And then, and then this that comes with... Flame throwing tripod. A little flamethrower and five minifigures. And you can get all of these these two sets here with all five figures for only $30. 30 bucks, 30 bucks is pretty sweet for this. 30 bucks. All right. Now we can move on to lot 18. All right. Well, you want to talk about this one? You, you know that one pretty well, right? I own this one. I'm somewhere. Exactly my point. It's somewhere in my house. I don't know where, but it's somewhere in my house. Uh, oh, before I say, can you do the Ninjago set separate tonight? What do you mean separate? He thinks, yeah, no, he means like, can you switch? If you want just the one, I mean, for full price, sure. I thought we said, like, if nobody else wants week, it, no taxi backs. No, Which I'm saying. Like, it yeah, it wasn't claimed yet. No, but I'm saying, if he wants, to, if he wants it separately, then I'll, I'll give it to you separately for full price, sure. But it's a bundle It'll tonight. Cost you. Uh, and we also have Frank claiming lot number 15. So Frank is claiming the Chima lot. It's gone. Now that we fixed it. That's a great deal, Frank. You're not going to be as disappointed for that for only 30 bucks. All right. So, lot 18 from Lego Castle. We have the Dragon Defender set here with two minifigures in excellent condition. I don't know why this dude's helmet is crooked. He must have got smacked in the head with a halberd. Um, so, we have two awesome little minifigures here as well as this awesome dragon catapult loaded with some one-by-one -one bricks here. And, of course, um, yeah, we probably have to separate this out a little bit. It hasn't been used too much. But the weight of the dragon head is actually the launcher. So when you pull this back, um, there's a lock down here. If I can get to it right here, which I think actually actually has to be reversed. Um, and then when you release this, the weight of the head will actually launch the projectiles in the back. So it's kind of like a dragon catapult, which is pretty dope. Um, so I do have this set at home. This one does come, I believe, complete with the instructions for only 20 bucks. And looks like Frank is claiming that one too. So Frank has claimed the castle lot. Castle is gone. All right. Next up here from Lego Friends, this here is the Jungle Rescue Base. That's pretty cool. So let's see here. We have three different friends. Nice little magenta or violet. I don't know if that one's right either, Sarah. You might have screwed that one up too. Because there's a second set on there. We're going to look at that one. It's just the, that's the but is the price right? We don't know. We're going to come back. All right. This is why things, yeah. yeah. Right. The price is right? Congratulations. What do you win? Nothing if you don't buy it. All right. We're going to go back to 19. Yep. Price is right. Okay. So this is the jungle base and whatever the car this is. <laughs> it's a little <laughs> hospital rescue base. And car. So you got a tree house, nice little rescue car, hedgehog, three characters, two monkeys. It's pretty nice. Oh, and a uh, restroom, you know. Little outhouse. So we've got, yep, we got some nice little figs here, nice little uh, vet. Little crash here. cart. 
you crash cars. Yeah, might as well <laughs> pretty be. much be. And then that's little car there, that's little purple raft. So tonight they can get both house. of these sets here for what? Hello, thirty-five. Thirty, yeah, thirty-five. Thirty-five dollars. Right there. there you go. So 35 bucks gets you all that friend stuff. All right. Freddy, you ready for this one? Yep. All right. All right. Here we go. Well, this is Tiger's uh, Command Base, I believe it's called. Mobile Base, maybe. Uh, uh -huh. But this is this yes. is actually a really cool set. This is uh, $55, originally $70. And uh, this can do some pretty cool things. So first, you have this uh, kind of attack mode. And then it shoots out discs. What? Which, which I'm going to do control. <laughs> Take it out. Got to make the pew pew sound. All right. Then you can you can do that. I just didn't want to you know shoot it. I got you. You can shoot Christopher. It's okay. Aww. Shoot him right in the gut. And then um, David's messing with my stuff. Make it stop. Stop touching stuff, Dave. Yeah. And then also you can uh, flip these doors in the front <gasps> down. These white doors. And then you have these little uh, what cycles that come out. There's little vehicles. Yeah, little. It's Did you not know that? The no. vehicle section. Really and then um, I did. I literally moved it over here. I haven't had a chance to look at it. Obviously, it has a mouth and then a steering wheel on top of here. And then uh, and there is a car on both sides, by the way. Oh yeah, get it over there. Yeah, there's two of them in here. Then you can uh, oh god, Whoa. you can take this. Oh wait, I didn't actually really look. There's a, uh, a spring loaded mechanism back. Spring loaded there. shooter. We gotta put the ramp down first. It. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> Vehicle mishap. Three Chima characters found dead. There you go. See. And then what is this like a radar car? Yeah, this is like I, I think it's. I think it's a radar uh, yeah, car. Yeah, because look, there's some control panels and stuff in there. And what I really like about this is that number one, you can put the tires down and they it sit by itself. And number two, oh, we can make um, it that'd be. It it's has like these, a recon it station. It has these guns actually on a ball joint, uh, like a mixel joint. So you can just turn these around no matter like what angle you want to get. You can get some pretty cool uh, trajectory on this. That's not the right word. <laughs> You angled through that. You're you're on the right path. I do not have a good grasp of the English. So this language. awesome convertible um, base mobile command center here also does come with a bunch of minifigures. Uh, it comes with six of them to be exact. And I actually have never seen one of these. Before. Yeah, that guy uses the, uh, the same piece as the B or the Bigfoot. Yeah, they're, they're the beaver. Yeah. that's awesome. Never saw that. I, I actually like really three like of them. Game. So there you go. Some seeing, some unique Chima figures if you're into Chima. Some dark tigers. I really like how they did this because it looks like he's got a just a big robot arm with blasters yeah. on it. And you also uh, you also have a little thing for your for a your launcher bad guys. Yeah. I think you're supposed to put one of these yeah, cylinders yep. on. Yeah, put the lights on. Yeah, pretty nice. So you get this entire Tiger Mobile Command Center here with all six figures for only fifty five bucks with the trucks. It's not bad. And this is the only time we've ever had this in here. Yeah, we've, we've never had this one. As the other Chima off. set, the only one we've had. We, we've, as I say, we've also never had, been, never had the uh, car before either. Yes, we have. Not built. Yes. Yeah. Not complete. Yeah. Because I had to start No. Yeah. Whatever. Moving on. Ryan's in denial. About a lot of things, I actually. I hear a lot when I saw a lot of problems. Uh, are there other Ninjago today? Uh, yeah, we yes, have a couple. Yes. Yep, there's yeah, always we have stuff. a couple. Uh, well, I will tell you guys. If you guys ask what's coming up, the answer is I'm not going to tell you. So you have to stay to watch if you want the to see what's up. Is, uh, uh, Frank is claiming lot number twenty. Jeez. So the tiger Sweet. is going. Shout out to Frank. Frank. That's Frank. an awesome set. I mean, look at this. This is like 14, 15 inches long. It's crazy. Well, the yeah. tigers are rare too, especially. The tigers are rare. Yep. Frank we had another one in here, which is the orange is. colored like this, and he was the most rare. Yeah, especially. With yep. These. Frank is really yeah. trying to win that thirty bucks. Yes. Remember, every every time you claim a lot, you do get a raffle ticket I mean, for that thirty dollars gift certificate. Frank doesn't win. It's rigged. I mean, it's it's he's, he's got a high like, chance, but you like, could still be like anyone in there. He's of the box at this point. <laughs> Not even. Uh, here, moving on. This is lot number 21. So this one here is another Vaki lot we have. So you get four different ones here, three with containers. I think they're, they're pretty cool. So they do the whole twist motion, as Freddie pointed out. Twist nice. and shot. So... Not only do you get these two guys again, but they both have their actual containers, especially the brown one. This one has and then you disc. get two extra ones here. Yeah, see, he's the only one that came in with the actual correct disc. disc. Right. And I did check the numbers to make sure they were actually correct, so that is the correct disc for them. So tonight, you can get all four of these and three containers here for $25. 25 bucks. Yeah, not bad. 25 bucks for, for four of these. And then 10 bucks. I mean... You might just as well buy them all and then get a collection. And then you have there two you extras of these. Why not? Yeah, yeah. Then, nice you, parts. then you can twist all over your house. <laughs> make, your, right. make your grandparents happy. Next up. And then uh, Frank says, I agree with Freddie. If, if, if he doesn't win, it's rigged. <laughs> 
Next up here from Lego Ninjago, this here is our Kai Pod, our ninja training pod here with a Dojo Kai, Lloyd and Nia. So we have all three of these here for uh, 15, fifteen bucks. Not bad, fifteen bucks. All right. Yeah, but you know. <laughs> Sorry. All right. So all right. there we go. So there's ready? lot number twenty-two for fifteen. Are you guys ready for what's next? Because you guys know what's next now. Rewind recap! <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right. Oh, geez, Dave, don't run into it. All right, folks, we're going to start out at the beginning here. Uh, lot number one was claimed. Lot number two is our intercoastal seaport set here for $30 off at 120 uh, includes five mini figures. Nice little ship here and the yard, including the trailer to carry your cargo. Comes with instructions for 120. Lot number three, we have Bordok and Zadok. And yes, I'm butchering all the bionicle names, so don't sue me. Uh, you get both of these bionicle figures here for 10 bucks. Lot number four is the helicopter pursuit from City Jungle Sets. Comes with three mini figures, the new alligator with the nice yellow eyes, as well as the helicopter and boat for only 30 bucks. Lot number five is our Ninjago Skybound figure lot here. Gets all eight figures for only $35. All right. Uh, looks like I've got Frank claiming lot number four. City Jungle set is gone. Congratulations to Frank. Uh, okay, moving on to lot number six. The Police Patrol set here uh, comes with instructions. All three minifigures with life vests. Of course, they have the regular standard faces. Um, awesome floatable boat. It does float in water and has a nice little engine hatch in the back to do your repairs and maintenance with um, a winch on the back and of course all the lights necessary to travel safely on the waters. Comes for only 30 bucks. Lot number six. Lot number seven is our uh, fire control center here for $70. Includes four minifigures. Um, instructions and the entire fire department with helicopter. Only $70. Lot number eight is our Bionicle two-pack lot, the Toa Matau, or Ma, yeah, Matau and Toa Hordika Wanua, which is the black one here. Uh, we have one set of two, so you get one of each, the green and the black, for $20. We do have two sets available, so we have four figures total, $20 for each set. What? Lot number nine is the current first adventure set from LEGO Minecraft. It comes with four minifigures, three animals, and a bunch of lava with water elevator and minecart. Which Where did the minecart go? Oh, my cart's in the bottom right now. There. I was like, where did the minecart go? Uh, you get this entire set for $55 off, $5 savings with instructions and box. $55. Lot number 10 is the airplane set. We're just going to call it airplane. It's actually part of an entire air, air, uh, airport. Thank you. I'm having a brain fart. Um, does not have any wheels, so it is wheelless. Um, has enough space in, in the inside, I believe, for 10 passengers as well as pilot and co-pilot. Comes with five minifigures and a little car here for only 45 bucks. Lot number 11 is going back to Bionicle. We have uh, Toa Hortica Wanua and Nuju uh, for $20. It's two pack. Lot number 12 is our old school 1985. That's the year it came out. 4.5 volt steam cargo train here. It takes three C batteries. Um, includes three minifigures. Everything you see here with extra track and instructions. Uh, for $150, that's $40 off. Lot number 13 was claimed. Lot number 14 is the Heart Lake Horse Show for $40. It includes two minifigures, two horses, and everything you need for a nice little equestrian run, including timer screen, uh, extra parts, and instructions for only 40 bucks. Lot number 15 was claimed. Lot number 16, going back to Bionicle. Yes, we have a lot of Bionicle. Uh, it all recently came in. We have Kurok, Lurok, and Turok for 30 bucks. Um, comes with 12 extra Krata to put inside to infect them or play with them, whatever you want to do, uh, for only 30 bucks. Lot number 17, going to Lego Ninjago, is Kaid's Blaze Cycle and Fangpire Truck Ambush for $75. You get both sets with six minifigures, including one of the Fangpire Generals, uh, for $75. Lot number 18 was claimed. Lot number 19 is the Jungle Rescue Base and Vet Ambulance. There we go. Um, with three minifigures, two monkeys, and a whole arrangement of stuff to help save the animals with instructions for only $35. Lot number 20 was claimed. Lot number 21, back to Bionicle, is the Nurok, Bordok, Zadok, and Kirok um, with three with containers, one with disc, 
uh, for only 25 bucks. If you are a Bionicle fan, I would get them as you can. And finally, we have lot number 22, which is the Kai Pod with Lloyd and Nia, um, all in their geese, uh, trading geese here for only $15. Boom, there it is. And of course, we have all of our new inbox stuff, which has been selling pretty quick lately. We've had a lot of kids off work, or off work, off school for spring break, so they've all been coming in. And of course, we're going to head over here to Freddy. What up, Freddy? Yeah. Freddy, you right. ready? Yes, I'm Is Freddy ready? ready? Ready, Freddy? All right, well, this is our Nexo Knights figure lot. Originally $38, now priced at $32. So you get a, you get a nice little discount there. And uh, this comes with, actually, I'm going to put this guy over here, so that way it's uh, more of a versus thing. But we have <laughs> um, two generic dudes. I mean, you can do pretty much whatever you want with him. You have Robin here, right? That's Robin, I think, yeah. In his, uh, in his Black, Black Knight suit, suit yeah. And then uh, Lance in his powered up mode. I really like this. Uh, what is this like? I was like Lance is white. Lance. Oh, I, I didn't watch next one. It doesn't. I didn't matter. either. I don't think anyone did. Disappointing. Uh, this cool is, sets though. That's awesome sets. Yeah, this is a Spider Darth Maul right here. This is this is a, a Clone Wars set. No, I'm just kidding. This is what is it, like Lavaria or something. That sounds yeah, right. I think it is. And then she has uh, snakes right here. So apparently in. Uh, uh, in addition to being Darth Maul, she's also Voldemort and uh, Chewbacca. <laughs> so you get you get a nice little Darth, variation. Darth Maul, Voldemort, Chewbacca, I'll put in one. Yeah, and then you have um, Mohawk dude right here. The worst. I like this Mohawk piece. It's, it's pretty nice. Mm -hmm. and he's uh, he's Legoless. So. <laughs> All right. So there you go. Legoless. This is yeah. your this is your terrible rendition of other figures for next night's. Uh, thirty-two dollars takes the entire lot home. I don't know so about you, but I think I think I think like Chewbacca, here. Darth Maul, Voldemort actually makes this more appealing. <laughs> Wouldn't that be an interesting name? What's yeah. your name, Chewbacca? What's your middle name, Voldemort? <laughs> what? Paul. That's not even one name. <laughs> I don't care. All right, moving on to lot number twenty-four. Dave, what do we got? All right, this here is from some really old school Marvel. This is the brick built Iron Wait, Man. Um. Yeah, that wasn't right, sir. Very Bionicle-esque. Do you see what happens when you move stuff, Dave? Yeah, Dave. What do you mean? I, I told you. Hold on. I told you. I told you six times. <laughs> David's this is for $20. Once I clocked out at five, I mean, like, Lot 24 for $20. Hold on, Mom. She's going to have to fix the entire thing now. David's not being very... 24. What do And that's what happens when All right, are we ready to get over there, sir? This is lot 24 for 20. Chris. All right, there we go. Go ahead, Chris. Go ahead, Dave. We're good. All right, here. This is the Bionicles version of Iron Man, which is pretty cool. It's more like Hero Factory. Uses yeah, more, more Hero Factory-esque. So this here is for $20. This is lot number 24. This came out, what, early 2000s? 2011. 2012. 2012. Ooh, we had Hulk here not too long ago, which is pretty nice. It was Hulk, Captain America... Iron Man, Batman, Joker, and Green Lantern. Green Lantern, you're right. It's fine, Sarah. It should be fine. Yeah, so this is pretty cool. I really like the the chest piece and the head. Those are my favorite parts on here. Like I said, like it'd be really cool to get this and just modify it more brick built so it's got actual hands yeah, and everything. Yeah. This would be really cool to have. Yeah, so you can pick up this buildable Iron Man with instructions for only twenty dollars. Not bad. Twenty bucks, not bad. Not bad at all. All right, moving over to lot 25, which is hopefully fixed and correct now. It's not. Oh my goodness. I can Delayed after this sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> let's just look at the ceiling, everybody. I'm look at the sponsor. ceiling. I, all right, let's just talk I, about I, it. I sponsored you with my greatness. <laughs> wow. Beware my presence. Oh, Ouch. I know. All right, Dave. If anything, all you're all sponsored. All right, away. so this year, lot number 25, as we fix actual verbiage on this. Chat here. Twenty four B. Okay. Whatever. So this one here, lot number twenty five. This here is the Temple of Light. Light. Lot twenty four. Temple of Light. Twenty five. Twenty five. Twenty five B. What? Oh my God. Twenty. What? We're just. I'm just gonna take this off so people don't get confused. So this here we have. It's the Temple of Light. For fifty five. For fifty five dollars. 
We're going to get that out of the way for at least. There you go. Lot yeah. 25. 25. Pretty sweet. Closes, opens. You can put 25. You can, you can put this guy in here and you summon him 55. to to fight to fight Lord Garmadon here, which is pretty nice. This is one of the one of the older sets. You can get a golden Lloyd in here. I, I really like it. It's got some cool play features too. I believe you shift this. Trap door. It's got all four elemental blades here, which is pretty nice. Ice, fire, lightning, earth. Mm -hmm. Pretty sweet. And I, I still like the old style golden mech. I think it's pretty cool. Yeah. I like the Garmadon too because it has like the Overlord. Yeah, the Overlord style helmet and everything. Yeah, it's sweet. So you can get lot number 25, the Temple of Light with instructions. What is that, for two or three books of instructions there? Uh, Yeah, two books. Two books of instructions uh, for $55. Just lot 25 for 55 Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Next up here is a current Minecraft set. Freddie, you want to talk about this one? All right, sure. This is, let me find my place here. The Wolf <coughs> Farm. This current is set. A, yeah, actually a current set. This has um, three sheep as a baby normal white sheep, um, a red sheep, and uh, a, a yellow sheep. A dyed yellow sheep. Yeah, yep, you no, can dye the sheep. Yeah. That's what I did in ours. Do you say you cool. can dye in the sheep? You can Steve. dye the sheep. Oh, okay. I like how, D -Y -E yeah, I like dye. how Steve here has clippers. Yeah, Shears, no. not clippers. Oof. Shears. Do they you got to shear the sheep. Do they, do they cut? They shear the sheep. Yeah, they're... <laughs> Tell him he's wrong, guys. Oh Tell God. him he's wrong. Hashtag shears. And then uh, you oh have this little God. sheep house, and like this can actually come off. Right? Yeah, it's so you actually, to, uh, it comes apart. It basically could blow up. This is this is graphic, we which is kind of funny. Yeah, rip, rip all the legs YouTube. off. No, nope. you, yeah. you can't shear it. We can't, can't show this on YouTube. <laughs> you can't shear the sheep, the big one. Um, so you get this nice little wool farm with instructions in box. Of course, like we said earlier, these are 100 percent complete. Um, and that's, you can pick this up, lot number 26, for $18. That's interesting that you can, like, flip bricks and stuff to change the colors. Yep. Yeah, I also um, think it's a little crazy. Oh, oh, you can make a parrot with this. And then what else? Hold on. I'm going to double check this because I'm curious. Uh, a brick wall, a brick apparently. Wall. Make a brick. Boom, it's boom, a heart. Boom, wall. Oh, it's, oh, a, it's a heart. heart. Yeah, because oh, Minecraft hearts. is already dangerous enough. We we need some love. So you need some more love in you Minecraft. Could build a heart, a parrot, or... which is actually funny because one of their yeah. See, them, see, um, uh, not clippers. No, not clippers. Shears. I didn't say clippers. I said scissors. No, I'm talking about Kurt. Kurt did hashtag clippers. Ain't eh, wrong. Yeah, Shears. well, um, actually. Talk to Connor and then I'll tell you what's up. It's kind of that's kind of funny because one of the April Fool's jokes from Minecraft was that uh, there was a uh, hugs and kisses update where there was like. <laughs> Phones and stuff, and you can send virtual likes. It, it wasn't really. That's kind of cool, though. Interesting. Yeah. I think it's, I think it's clever that Lego did that. Yeah, I think that's that, that's a really yeah, that's cool sweet. way to elevate Lego, even though that's. You know, <laughs> all right. All right. Lot number twenty-seven. Hopefully, it's correct. All right. Yeah. There we go. It is the uh, I guess set. The VIP Mustang. VIP Mustang keychain. Yeah. So this was the. That, like, Turn, right? it's, yeah, yeah, it spins around. Uh, but this was the VIP exclusive gift if you got the Lego Mustang Creator set. Yeah, that's so pretty we nice. We have this here for uh, 15 bucks, and that's that's not bad. Yeah, Something look at that. that. Flips. You can only get for getting like a hundred. Flips the Lego. Set. That's pretty sweet. That's a heavy duty uh, keychain too. Yeah, that's, that. that'd be nice to to have in your keychain, especially if you yeah. own a Mustang. No, I think that's pretty. That'd be pretty nice. Yeah. Sweet. Next right. up here. This is a unique one. Yeah. The Day of Play exclusive poly bag. So this here was part of a special event that happened from Lego. You said Only in 2019 before before uh, COVID happened. Yeah. Do we say that on YouTube now? Like, because I know a lot of people like in the early days of it were like getting demonetized for saying COVID. Whatever. It's COVID. Right. Let's go. Yeah. Um, oh, just and we got uh, Frank is claiming the keychain. Oh, nice. Shout so out to Frank, Frank here. Keychain's done. So this one here came out with some pretty unique figures and torsos you can mix and match together. And then these are all printed bricks. So one says emotional, one says social. There's a nice QR code to scan on this. And it's, it's brand new. It's, it's pretty sweet. So this here we have tonight for... 40 bucks. 40 bucks? Yep, normally 50, it's 20% off. Okay. Um, and to give it some more background, um, so the day of play is the only day um, that all LEGO employees have off. The only day of play? Off. The only day of play? Yes. Um, that uh, all the LEGO employees had off to actually go play and enjoy other things besides LEGO. 
Um, and back in 2019, um, when the set was released, um, was the first time they ever invited the kids of Denmark to join them in their day of play. Um, and this is what was given out to those kids and stuff. And I forgot exactly what they did all these for, but it was like different types of uh, learning and creativity, um, which is why they have like the cognitive, um, social, cognitive, yeah, social. Uh, I don't know what move on means. It's some Denmark Danish like thing. And to answer anybody's question, if they ask. No, we have not scanned the QR code yet, but I probably will just to see what happens. It's probably just a link to the, yeah. the website, but it is brand new, and I will tell you, no one else in the U.S. has this currently available but us. So, boom. That, that makes me want This to is the it. second time we've had this hit. Everything else, everything else is overseas. Second? Yeah. Like, usually, usually like this. Hungary, Denmark, yeah. Netherlands, stuff like that usually have a boat. Nope, no one there. All right, next up here, this is lot number 25. This is our Marvel. 29. Yeah, lot number 29. He said 25, didn't he? Yeah, he did. No, he said 29 just really fast. 25. <laughs> you said 25. See, not 25. <laughs> Whatever. I, I, I don't even care now. I'm all mixed up. So this here is our Marvel's Alien Pack. So we have two Sakaran in here, two different Outriders, and the newest Chitari with a cool little Sakaran pod. So we thought this would be a cool idea to throw in some Marvel aliens because we don't really do a lot of bad guy stuff here. No, nope, everyone's always good guy, bad guy, good yeah. guy, good guy. So no we thought this would be really cool. You get a variety of stuff. You could add. We have other ones if you want the other two versions of these that we have in. Uh, it's just it's pretty sweet. So now you got one that could be on the ground. One could fly in space and on air. So okay, if you want some extra enemies to fight your Marvel Avengers or Guardians of the Galaxy or Black Panther or whatever you want. Here you go. Rest so, in peace. So we have this here tonight for 30 bucks. Okay. There you go. Lot number 29 for 30 bucks. Moving on to lot number 30. All right. This is the... I think the last bionicle lot of the night. Oh, <laughs> Thank okay. goodness. Spend your shekels on this one or you yeah. may never spend any shekels again. There you go. Yeah. So what do you so, have here for lot number 30? This is a uh, Thok. He's a uh, Paraki. Or Paraki. Paraka. Paraka. I was thinking of Byraki. Bionicle uh, Paraka. By the, by the way, if... if uh, you go on YouTube. You should check out the shorts that they made for both these guys and the Byrocky. Or Byrocky. You're getting words confused. Byrocky, I'm, I'm, these have all words are all made up. They're, it's all relative, okay? So don't judge me. Anyway, <laughs> so this is Doc. This is a uh, he. There's a lot of white on him, and uh, he he has he has claw hands. He has claw hands. He has he's probably he's has, got a couple of different things. So this way this way is a blaster. Oh really? It's more like a gun. That's cool. It's like a little ice gun. And but then, then as he says, yeah, you can flip it around and it turns into like a, a long scythe so in other words, weapon like here. So in other words, he has like a switchblade on his own. Yes, yeah, he, he does. He literally has a switchblade. And then the other side is actually a pinnacle ball shooter. You, you would push this here and oh, yeah. And the balls actually are inside. Oh, really? Uh, we just don't want to lose them. Um, and the nice thing is if you tilt his head up, and then you can actually push that little button on top of his head in the oh, back. Oh, right here? Yep. And then that... What does that do? Oh, like his eyes light up. There's oh, a little battery in there, and his eyes light up. It's a little switch. Oh, that's uh, cool. So his eyes glow as well. So this is Thok uh, from Bionicle Paraka, lot number 30 for 18 bucks. That's actually a pretty good deal for, you know, an old-style Bionicle set, especially if you, you need this to what? complete your set or something like that. I don't want to lose saying lot number 29, or number 29 for. Oh, just 29. it might have been because David said me and you. Oh, right, 25. Five. Yeah, he's in hashtag 29. He said, yeah. All right, lot number 31, what do we got? All right, this is our coastal rescue base for 90 bucks. This has, uh, I think this is supposed to be like a little uh, Coast Guard vehicle, right? This is the old Coast Guard set, yeah. yep. And then, to go uh, with the Coast Guard cutter we had on the show last week. Yeah, and this, yeah. Um, this can open up and you can put some people on there. I think if you wanted, technically, you could also put, like, I, I, that's not going to work, not never mind. <laughs> By the way, even though these, these vehicles, these old 90s vehicles are, are so much smaller and they're only four wide, that would actually be more of a human scale. Yeah, that's true, actually. So it's kind of funny. I also you know, really like, like um, this kind of reminds me of like a mash Jeep kind of. Yep. Yeah. Kind of it's actually looks pretty like spot on. A little old JP1 or whatever. Yeah. Like the, um, I, I believe they were called Mutts in, uh, in, in, because the 1950s, like Vietnam, Korean style Jeeps were called Mutts because they actually, um, I believe, uh, well, because they, they had Parts several, of all, many other vehicles. Well, they had, um, they had a lot of, uh, different names because under the Lend-Lease program they gave them to the Soviet Union because pretty much um, they needed a 4x4 a vehicle during World War II 
and originally a different company designed it and they said we like your design but we don't like you and they gave it to ford and ford made it and uh that was the the version that was used mostly by you know the people in world war ii and then they gave those earlier models and some of the newer models to uh their allies in france and um you know uh different countries like that specifically the soviet union so if you see a bunch of jeep variations they are actually probably not used by the U.S. military. They are more likely used by Britain and France <laughs> and uh, Soviet Union. I'm getting way off track. Yes, you are. Kurt actually just said history with shekels. Yes, exactly. history, with shekels. History, shekels. history with Mr. Shekels. Yeah, Mr. Um, shekels. So yes, this set here uh, does come complete with uh, four minifigures. Yeah, and there's there's a there's a control panel in here. As well as a nice little helicopter, two sure vehicles, and trailer, is backwards. Backwards. and uh, instruction book for ninety dollars. That's yeah, nine zero dollars. Yes, there's a winch, yes, there's like, a winch on like the Coast witches. Guard. There you go. So lot number thirty-one, ninety dollars. You have your sign that goes wee wee. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. What do we got, Dave? All right. Next up here, this is back. We haven't done this in a long time, but I'm excited to really talk about this. But. I will warn you, it is only half of what I'm about to show you. So this here, lot number 32, this is our Stranger Things house, literally just the house. There's no upside down on this side. Stranger Things have happened. <laughs> <laughs> so this here, we have the booklets, we have most of the figures except for Dusty. We have a ton of extra parts and the tree. And yes, this these, is the, these are actually all the connected parts and yeah. the other, parts for the other tree. And this so. is the tree with the stickered missing barber piece here. So tonight we have this here for the lucky customer of choice for a hundred dollars. Jeez, hundred bucks. That's Wow. It's not bad. No, because it has, like, the good parts of the set. Like, it has most of the figures. I mean, yeah, look inside of this. Yeah, it's literally missing Dusty. Yeah. yeah, and it literally has the best part of the set. Dusty in a whole other house. The, I mean, the like, Jeep? Yeah, the Jeep's pretty dope. I like Jeeps because I'm a nerd, so. I yes, if you're a fan stuff. of Stranger Things, you got a lot it's of different like things in here. I want, to, I want to take this off, but I, I don't want to. Really and then uh, all these little connectors here, are if you have the bottom side, you can flip, it, flip that side over and then connect them that way. Which was a really, really smart play by Lego. Yes, it was. And this just comes off with a whole peg. There's a pumpkin inside. That's great. I, I love that. Which vehicle. eventually it's, ended up rotting. Yeah. I really like this vehicle. It's definitely one of the best like brick-built vehicles that Lego has designed and made. I really want one of them. It's cool because they side-built the windows in here. It's a very nice old 80s style truck. I yes. really want one of those. I think that's like a Bronco, right? Yeah. It is very very based off of Bronco, yes. Yeah. I don't know what it is about people asking about a SpongeBob case. We don't have a SpongeBob, SpongeBob? case. Sorry to tell you guys. We probably have some spon spon some spon ugh, some Sponge SpongeBob Bob. figures, yeah, but we do not have a case. Ball figures for a bunch of SpongeBob figures if you're interested. In there are some in the in the ball yeah. figures. You're yeah, correct. I, I, believe, I, believe, I can, I can, I can <laughs> list them off the top of my head. They had a bunch of uh, different variations of SpongeBob, like astronaut SpongeBob. They had uh, uh, Mr. Krabs. I know Mr. Krabs is like a Pretty rare figures. Okay. Right. So moving on to lot number 33. Lot number 33, this is our biggest lot of the evening. Yes, it this is. This here is an old castle set. So we have three different sets here. And the reason why we did this is because if anybody claims this tonight, you get this awesome old castle poster. Shoot. Which is pretty sweet because all three of the sets are right here on top. This like, is like a castle battle. Royale. Look at that. Look at that. It would have been really cool to have these other two, but I think just to have these three for the top half of the poster is pretty nice. Yes. So Wow. Are... We... <laughs> Let me get we... You didn't even have to say anything. I knew Frank, it. Frank? It Frank? I knew Shout it. out to Frank. I called that. So, <laughs> so congratulations to Frank on that one. But yes, we have Magisto, Mag Magisto's Magical Workshop, which I believe is this one. We have the dragon wagon, which is over here with the dragon and, and the, the horses fire attached. Fire breathing fortress. And the fire breathing fortress. Let's be as honest. well, which comes with all of these awesome mint condition two figures. Like, let's be honest. Really two cool. green dragons. With two wizards. Yep. Three horses. Two wizards. A yep. bunch of different knights. And instructions for all of them. Right. Instructions with for the all poster. Of them and the poster. So shout out to you, Frank. I, I knew you would like this. That's why I made sure it came in. Yeah. And then, of course, it's, it's so funny because we just got all this stuff in. So this, you guys are the first people to see these things. So Don't we automatically know that Frank is going to buy something like when we start the show. No, because no, he's like, pretty new. So we can't guarantee his. I mean, like, but 
But Frank Frank is a '90s fan. This he likes a lot of the, the vintage stuff. Right I, mean, I don't. I don't blame him. <laughs> this is an awesome line. I was this very is. happy to get these in. We've had these. I would have taken them home if it wasn't for that person. Oh. <laughs> but I got. But I got other sets. We'll show in a second here too. So. Yep. All right, Jay. What do we got for Next lot number thirty-four? Here is lot number thirty-four. This here is our dots. Our bracelet. dot lot. Our dot lot. Is our that dot what you lot. Call it? That's right. Our dot lot. Dot bracelet lot. So we have four different bracelets and two clam packs here tonight. For Frank says Castle is the best. Twenty bucks. Twenty Not bucks. Bad. That's right. You Not get four bad. bracelets and Five, two extra 10, packs 15, for only twenty bucks. So you're getting two extra packs for free. For free. For free. Yep, and we don't ever discount new stuff. So for the first time ever, you're getting a discount. If it's the first time receiving eight bucks for free. So if you guys want something, especially if you're looking for some Easter basket fillers, these these are these would be great. Baskets. If you have young ladies or gentlemen at home that would love to put some bracelets on, I would have actually gotten the black one, but my wrist is too fat. It's about the only thing that could fit my wrist right now. Which is yeah, which has also been on here for three years. So go figure. What? Yep, I designed this one actually for the whole company. Yep, Dave's got one too. Well, I thought you said you've had it on your hand for three years. I have. It hasn't come off. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I've Ever. Had, I've had this one on for seven months. It's got, it's got a nice. Uh, You've been taking them off like a that. nice tinge on the backside of of the dirt and the yeah. probably. I had a different one before probably this. So. Suntan too. Probably. Oh, I had I have a, I had a suntan ring there before, yeah, but I, I don't I don't get out much anymore, you know, because I'm always here. All right, next up here, this one is a current Minecraft set we recently got in. This one here is the Warped Forest, which is pretty cool. I, I do like this set. We actually had this here brand new, but it sold out already in like two days. Right, so it's crazy so that it's, we have one gone. still brand new. It's just not, you know, in yeah. box. I really like this, this whole bull or moose or whatever you want to call it. Like a something. It's in. whatever I refer to because I don't do Minecraft. <laughs> so, yeah. And then we've got some pigments. Hoglin and Piglin. Hoglin. Hoglin and Piglin? Hoglin. Hoglin. Let me see. I'm going to say if it's called a Piglin, Hoglin and Piglin. Piglin. What's the girl? What's the Hoglin. what's the uh, pig's name? No, this is Hoglin. This one is Hoglin. And what's the pig name? What's the girl's name? Or I don't name? Know. She is Huntress? Huntress. Yes. Not uh, to be confused with Yes, the Piglin, Hoglin, Hoglin, and Huntress. There you go. Um, and of course, has this awesome little functions where all the trees fall apart, and the lava falls yeah, down, so and it falls apart, and all sorts this, of craziness. This, I think, yep, pulls out. There oh, there go. he goes! Lava falls. I like these little eight-bit flame stacks. Yes, this is they're so really dope. sweet. And then there's a function here to blow the tree up. This is also known this as purgatory for children. <laughs> wow. Um, so you can get this new, currently new set, uh, five dollars off because it's built. Um, but it does come complete with the instructions and box in mint conditions. Yeah, that's uh, pretty cool. But you guys get this for only 25 bucks while it's here because it won't really last like long. This bit, it's uh, so that's only, that's lot 35 for $25. When I see this, I think of like the sound effects in an old 8 bit game. You, like, can, <laughs> you, can, you can burn <laughs> <for> your sins. <laughs> All right, folks, before we get to our mystery boxes here tonight and our, and our recap here, I do want to touch base on one new thing. You guys get a sneak peek. At this month's new display and scavenger hunt, uh, we will let you guys know that on this display, um, and the scavenger hunt is going to be for a raffle prize. So if you do come in and complete it, which is, I believe, Dave, how many things did you have on that list? Was it like about 28? 32. 32 items that you have to find in here. Um, when you do so, you will earn yourself a raffle ticket that we put in a separate box to earn another prize. Um, it is a lot of fun, and uh, Dave and I had a lot of fun putting this together and putting some brand new sets in there. As you can see, we've got Winnie the Pooh's uh, new house, which we just finished this morning. Uh, we also have Sesame Street hanging out over here. So if you want to come and hang out with us at Sesame Street. And uh, we also have the newer donut shop over here. So we've got a lot of cool sets in here um, to check out, for sure. All right, Dave. What do we got over here for our mystery boxes? How do those mystery boxes work? Yes, you want to I'm tell very, them? I'm very ready. I'm so pumped. So how do mystery boxes work? So mystery boxes work where, um, number one, we, we tell you that there's mystery boxes, so you're not alarmed. Number two, uh, Ryan asks me if I know how mystery boxes work. And then third, I explain how mystery boxes work, and they work like this. So pretty much, um, we, we, have, we have three mystery boxes today. We have green, yellow, and red. I know my colors. Mm -hmm. And then um, 
if you if you give us your shekels in the requested amount that we ask for, we will open this magical box of joy for you, and you get whatever's inside, but not the box because we don't allow that here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so tonight Very for our mystery boxes, dull explanation <laughs> like stale <laughs> face, Freddy. <laughs> <laughs> We've got our green mystery box for twenty dollars. Which is lot number 36. You can say lot number 36 or green mystery box or just green. For the, these, will change it. And of course, I, these. I also got to say, up boxes, I also we, gotta we say for these two mystery boxes, there is something bonus that comes with them. Wow. I can. A bonus. A bonus. Did you tell me about the bonus? I don't think I know about the bonus. You're the, you're the one who set these up, so. Did I? Yeah. I don't even remember what they are. <laughs> See? I do. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So the so we have the green one for what twenty? We have the yellow box for 18. twenty for eighteen. Yep, lot number thirty seven or yellow for eighteen. And we have the red or lot thirty eight for fifteen. So you must claim the lot before we tell you what is in it and open it so up for you, but you must two? accept it. Yes. As what he said. These two boxes, the Yellow and green come with bonuses for what you get in here. And the red box is just something cool. Something for kids to really use for school. And that's all I'm telling you. There you go. Um, Liam is asking any BVS or JL sets. I don't know what he's talking about. Just like oh, said, or... Oh, nope. Actually, let me tell you a cool story. All right. Well, make it quick because we have a claim. So make it quick. All right. First and foremost, we've got chicken bricks. Doing a claim on lot 38, which is our red box for 15. That's correct. I hope. Wait, 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 wait. And it is. Okay. That was just because we're just trying to be part of something important. So you get this two by four mini box of just awesomeness. You can put your shekels in it. It's a mini shekel. You get a sharpener to do all kinds of stuff colored pencils, regular pencils. Hopefully although, not your finger. Yeah, hopefully yeah, not your finger. Don't stick your finger in the hole. Yeah, that'd not be good. So this is pretty cool. Easy to clean out and everything. All fresh in the green. And this awesome pencil case. Look at that. It is a two by six plate pencil case. This is for exception right here. Two by yeah. six? You mean? Yeah. Yeah, two, two by, by six. six. Well, okay, never mind. Man. <laughs> My mind just blew up a little bit. So there you go. So you get a pencil case, a nice little storage block, and a pencil case. You said pencil, pencil sharpener. For 15 bucks. For only 15 bucks. So congratulations oh, yeah. to Chicken Bricks. Yay! Shout out to the Bricks of Chicken. Uh, Kurt's asking any Star Wars since there wasn't any Star Wars lots. There are no Star Wars lots tonight. Uh huh. Oh, but there is, but they don't know. Uh -huh. they, maybe they do. Why did you say that? Because I did. It's okay. <laughs> uh, wow. All right, Liam, let me tell oh, you. Oh, right. Give them a head. So, give them a head so again, we have our green and yellow mystery hits. boxes left. Our green one was $20, I believe. 18. And then our yellow is 18. 18. 18. So green for 20, yellow for 18. Liam, I, Eeny, I meeny, you. miny, mo, which one's going home with you? All right. So on that note, we're going to let you guys mull over if you guys would like one of those two mystery boxes. Of course, uh, yellow is 18 and green is 20. With bonuses. Um, with some bonuses. And we're going to do our final recap. And, of course, don't forget, we still have a small handful of our Easter baskets available for our event tomorrow at 3 o'clock. Or you may p purchase them or claim them and pick them up later um, as long as they're picked up by next Sunday as well as all of your stuff. Um, people are asking about the Star Wars case. Sure, you can see it, but I don't know what you're going to see because it's really covered in a lot of uh, darkness right now because of our paper being on top. And Liam, I'm going to tell you right now, if you wanted Justice League or Batman v Superman sets, that time has, has passed because um, I picked up the, uh, the Night Trawler a while ago, and right after, I bought it for 30 bucks on Bricklink News. Uh, the Flash figure, the cheapest you could get it from the U.S. was actually 30 bucks. So... If you want those sets, you should have got them two weeks ago. All right, Chad, I'm not sure which one you're trying to claim, but you have to type it out as I claim lot number whatever for the amount. Yes. I don't understand what claim 18 is. You, you must type to, it all out you, as you as seen trailer. on the your display below here. It should be right there. Oh, yeah. yeah so you must type it like that. Um, so, again, we have our lot number 36 for 20, which is our green mystery box, and our lot number 37 for 18. I don't, I don't know. Uh, for, uh, okay, we've got 20. Uh, Robert is claiming lot number 20. All right, Robert. Lot, sorry, lot green. We know what it meant for 20. Yeah. I got, yeah, that's 20, that one's 18. You get this awesome 
Jr. Lego Movie 2 set. And not only do you I get Emmett and Benny's little vehicle sets, you get da, 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 this awesome minifig pack Woo. with Apocalypse Babies. The bad babies. Sewer babies. Bad babies. Sewer. Not to be confused with Nightmare. Huh? Yeah. So you get all these here tonight for the $20. Wow. Yep. So Robert gets to take those home. All right. Shout out to you, Robert. Congrats. All right. I'm going to give it. This is, this is Ted's first time on. I know Ted was in here earlier. Uh, he is. He's got it kind of spread it apart, but he is going to claim Lot Yellow for 18 Lot wow. Yellow for 18 You get this awesome celebratory Luke Skywalker. Look at that. And not only do you get the Luke Skywalker, but you get the book! That came with it. Da -da -da -da, da, so da, this da, is da, an da, old school da. Star Wars book. Which is pretty cool. Look at that. The old Cloud City is in here. Oh, pretty. <gasps> the books are, yeah. Very, very expensive. Yeah, the so. books and, and the cloud card we had. Books and, yeah, I mean, the cloud card we have. Okay. Yeah. So there you go. So congratulations, to Ted, on Lot Yellow for 18. Lot Yellow. We're, I mean, so that means it's officially time for our recap. Rerun recap. Ooh. And then we go all the way. We're going all the way back to Lot Number One. All right. For those of you who have not been here since the beginning, we have Lot Number One, which is claimed. Lot Number Two, which is our intercoastal seaport for $120, includes five figures, boat, and crane dock, with instructions for $120. Lot number three is one of our mini Bionicle lots, which is Bordock and Zadok for $10. Lot number four was claimed. Lot number five is our Skybound figures from Lego Ninjago. We have eight figures here for $35. Lot number six is our po police patrol boat does float. Our patrol police patrol boat that floats. How about that, folks? Uh, we have three mini figures that comes included with this nice little engine bay um, and boat with instructions for only $30. Lot number seven is our fire control center for seventy dollars. Includes four mini figures, um, water fire truck essentially, tr uh, car, and helicopter with station for only seventy dollars. Lot number eight we have two packs or two sets of this two pack of Toa Matau and Toa Hordika Wenua for twenty dollars. So it's uh, one set of two for twenty. So you get the green and the black for twenty dollars. We have two sets, so you can buy two or four. Lot number nine for the current Minecraft sets. We have the first adventure set here with mint box and instructions for $55. Uh, how about lot three? Yeah, and it's only $10. Um, anyway, uh, we have lot number 10, which is the airplane without wheels. Um, has plenty of room inside for many, many, many passengers. I think it's like 10. Um, comes with five minifigures and little transport car with instructions for 45 bucks. Lot number 11 from Bionicle is Tor Hordika Winua again with Nuju, so they're both part of the same line with all the extra accessories, pull tabs, and discs. Um, comes complete with the um, containers for 20 bucks. Lot number 12, going back many, many, many a year, if our, my phone wants to actually move, there it goes. Um, is our 1985 4.5-volt steam cargo train, uh, which is powered by three C batteries that you'll have to put into this lovely tender right here. Um, comes with three minifigures, forklift, and instructions with extra track um, for one one at 50 normally priced at $190. Uh, Bingus! We haven't heard from Bingus in a long time. It is claiming lot number 11. Congratulations to Bingus. Boop, boop, boop. Gone. Uh, lot number 13 was claimed. Lot number 14 uh, is the Heart Lake Horse Show for $40. Includes two minifigures, two horses, and everything you need for your equestrian runs. It includes instructions and I believe 100% complete for $40. Bucks. Lot number 15 was sold. Lot number 16, back to Bionicle, is Kurok, Lurok, and Turok for $30. Includes extra 12 uh, Krata. Or a little three, six, nine. I think it's three, is it three or four. I think it's three. It's nine crowded inside, and then one each in these guys in the Rakshi here. Um, so you get 12 total with three Rakshi um, for $30. It's lot number 16. Lot number 17 from Lego Ninjago. We have Kai's Blade Cycle in Fangpire Truck Ambush for $75. Includes all six minifigures. Um, Kai's Bike, the awesome Fangpire um, Ambush car here, whatever. It's probably about 20 inches long with the tail. It's a big car. 
um, with Kai, with Zane's little motorcycle bike here uh, for 75. Uh, lot number 18 was claimed. Lot number 19 from Lego Friends is the Jungle Rescue Base and Vet Ambush, or Vet Ambulance, my bad. Um, with three figures, there's one over here, so three mini figures, two monkeys, and a bunch of things to help rescue your animals with instructions for only 35 bucks. Lot number 20 was claimed. Lot number 21 from Lego Bionicle is our Nurok, Bordok, Zadok, and Kirok um, for $25 for this four pack. Lot number 22 is our Kaipod with Mia and, and Lloyd uh, for only 15 bucks. And then we're going to swing around to the front. All right, brings us to lot number 23, our next night figures. You get six different figures as shown here for $32. Nice little lot of minifigs for next nights. Lot number 24 is our buildable Iron Man for $20. Includes instructions. We just got this in two days ago. Lot number 25 is our Temple of Light with our golden white mech here for golden gold boy here. Um, includes five minifigures, the entire temple, and instructions for only $55. Bucks. Lot number 26 is the Wool Farm from LEGO Minecraft, currently available as well. But with scissors! Oh my god. With shears, we got Steve with shears, along shears, with uh, awesome. three sheep, um, and then a little big sheep here, which Dave keeps ripping the head off because he's a masochist. Um, <laughs> and uh, with instructions and box uh, for eighteen dollars. Lot number twenty-seven was claimed. Lot number twenty-eight was a twenty nineteen exclusive Lego Playday Poly Bag set, um, which was unique to Denmark, as far as I know. I believe it was only Denmark. Um, it was given to the children for the first time ever. Uh, that's lot number 28 for $40. Uh, looks like we've got Frank claiming lot 24, the Iron Man. If you want to flip that over. Congratulations to Frank for the Iron Man. Uh, lot number 29 is our Marvel Alien figure lot here with all the bad guys. Uh, we do have Dave Woods on this here. Again, we have some... Oh my gosh, I can't even talk Two right Sakaran, two Outriders, and one Chitauri with an... Pod. With a scar pod? <laughs> a scar and pod? Yes. Yeah. Uh, so you get all of those five figures in the little ship there for 30 bucks. 30 bucks! Next up, we have our light up fate, light up eyeball here. Uh, sock. Mm -hmm. uh, it's hard to see on the, the thing here. Or Dave's not pushing it hard enough. Um, <laughs> with instructions and container here for only $18. Next up, we have lot number 31, which is our coastal rescue base. Oh my gosh, this thing is getting a little. Here. Uh, Coastal Rescue Base here. This is part of like the Coastal Cutter series from like 1995, I believe. Um, comes with two vehicle or two cart land vehicles, I should say. Uh, rescue Chopper, four mini figures, and instructions to go with the lovely little base here for only ninety dollars. Lot number twenty-two or thirty-two from Stranger Things. That is the top half of the Upside Down. Um, does not include Dusty, but has all of the other figures, including Hopper's truck. Um, and one of the trees with the extra parts for the other tree um, with both books of instructions for only $100. It's half off for half the set. Right, Dave? Yep, half off for half the set. There you go. Lot number 33 for this awesome castle line was already claimed. Lot 34 was our dot lot for $20, I believe. Yes, $20. Um, comes with four bracelets and two extra packs, which uh, has some awesome little tile... Um, what do they call them now? Little charms, I guess, is, yeah. is kind of what they're going for now. It's like Pandora, um, but for kids. Yeah, right. Kids Pandora that's an, uh, at a quad, like a sixteenth of the cost. All this is one third the cost of one, one charm. One B, yeah, one B. Yeah. One charm for a Pandora bracelet. <laughs> and then we have lot number thirty-five, which is the Warp Forest as well from Minecraft. Um, comes with three minifigures and this awesome little animal here, um, with some crazy colors. I love the teal. I love all the, the teal bricks. Oh, uh, yeah, the Hogman. Um, with Hogman, whatever. Um, with the instructions and the box for only 25 bucks. Not too bad. And all three mystery boxes are claimed, so shout out so to you guys who claim them. We yep, had, we had Ted, Ted Frank, and I believe, was it Canceled Car? Or was it Chicken Bricks? Chicken, chicken, bricks. Bricks. chicken, chicken bricks. bricks got it. All right, and for those of you who are asking about SpongeBob minifigs, we have SpongeBob minifigs in our ball table, so you can get any of these for five dollars a piece. Yeah, I don't know if we have any more ball. I don't know if we have any more in our regular case, right? These are all in the balls. Uh, I have a couple ones. Yeah, a couple. But only a couple. Yeah, I put um, more. Than one 
Let's hour. see. I know people were asking about Star Wars before. We don't have a whole lot of Star Wars. We do still have a Razor Crest in here. We actually have another one that we're going to be certifying here shortly. Um, we do have the Millennium Falcon down there, as well as both of Poe's, or two of Poe's X-Wings, the black and the white with the orange. Uh, we have our little Jakku sets here, with his, which is Ray Speeder in the um, Jakku Encounter set that we had on our stream last week, as well as Naboo Starfighter. And if you have a base at home, we have plenty of Star Wars little vehicles and turrets available for you to add to your mocks. And of course, we have buildable Luke Skywalker. You can have some fun with later. Uh, but we are very light on Star Wars. I don't know if we have much else Star Wars. Um, what's up, Freddy? We do still have some old certified underwater sets and um, space sets here, as well as uh, a bunch of friends. We've got friends galore here. We've, we've got to clean up the shelves here. But we've got lots of friend sets here. We've got some old um, the, the Ninjago um, mechs that we had on the stream way back when. So we've got the Quake mech, we've got the Ice Tank, we've got the Ninja Dragon still available. Um, we've got... Uh, if you guys are uh, expensive taste, we have the UCS Tumblr set 100% complete as well for a big smacking 500 bucks. Uh, we have the Lego Chima Castle up here. We've got some of the newer sets that are still 100% complete. And I just stepped on something I don't know. You did. Um, as well as some old or Minecraft sets as well certified with some Harry Potter trains. So we've got a bunch, but we are also a little bit light because we've been very, very busy this week with everybody being on spring break. When do you say, Dave? I think we're pretty busy, weren't we? Yeah, no, we've definitely been busy all week. So thank you guys for coming to visit us this week. I hope we have a busy weekend. I think with Easter Sunday and everything. I think I think we're going to be pretty busy tomorrow, but I think we're going to be dead on Sunday. Yeah, I want to be so? here every day. I don't know. Like, they won't let me live here. So. <laughs> but I think, I, I will say too, uh, if for those uh, fans who are Star Wars fans um, watching this stream with Freddie back there saying to me too, um, we do have an MTT that has been sitting here for a little while that we are unfortunately going to have to build um, because we do not um, know how many bags are in there. So we might actually be the first people on YouTube to actually announce and show off how many yeah, bags are in there. Can I, can I build and buy it? Um, Maybe. What? Can I build and buy it? If you have the $450 it's going to cost after you then. Oh. Ask my mom. <laughs> <laughs> I think she's watching. <laughs> she hasn't said anything yet. Uh, we have AJ. Like, no! no! Right? <laughs> AJ is asking about the Skybound figure lot. Yes, you can. Uh, we do have these guys all available here for you. And again, these guys are $35 for the lot. You get eight minifigures here. And two of them are the same with the gliders, but they are slightly different gliders from different sets. And you can get that for lot number five for 35 bucks. Um, if you guys are also interested in older vintage -y stuff, um, we do also have some other police and fire stations as well as some um, post carrier sets as well. We've got a bunch of other stuff on our top shelf here. And uh, we have a bunch of Arctic sets still available. So we've got a lot of things going on. Uh, but if you guys are interested in those, please, please, please let us know. If you did order something, uh, just let us know if you need help with shipping or we expect you to be here next Sunday to pick it up. Um, Dave, what else we got going on? Anything? Uh, no, I think we're pretty set. I mean, Ryan, you have the Easter basket event going on oh. at 3 tomorrow. We've got uh, AJ claiming lot number 5 for 35 bucks. Ah, nice. going to take care of that. All right. Shout out to AJ. And Frank says, great job, Freddie. Somebody actually compliments. That makes one person. Uh, we need some compliments for Freddie. He's feeling a little down. Come on, give him some. Give him some love. I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't like. I wouldn't call it down. I would call it a constant stream of I'm not feeling so good. That's, <laughs> That's called, called depression. It's called, it's called Spider Man syndrome. Wow. All right. Uh, but yes, we do have. I don't feel so good. We do have so our good. Easter baskets available tomorrow. Uh, as you can see there, past Freddie. Uh, we've got one pink. Four green and two blue left. Uh, they are twelve dollars a piece, and we are having our event tomorrow at three o'clock to build these awesome little Easter baskets. If you would like to skip the event, you may just pick it up anytime you'd like. Um, it does come with the instructions as well, so designed by me. Uh, what else we got? We got uh, da, 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 da. we got Easter coming up on Sunday. Um, we are open Easter Day. Yes. And then Ryan, Regular gonna, hours on Sunday. Ryan, are you going to have the scavenger hunt for this weekend? Yes, we are. Scavenger sure? hunt starting tomorrow morning. Sure? 
Yeah. Closet? Yeah. Uh huh. 100%. I know you got photos. 100%. I, I know do have photos. I tripod over here to get photos. I do. I have photos ready. Yep, I, I took them while you were in the other room. I know. I saw. <laughs> uh, Kurt says, Good job, Shekel Boy. <laughs> No, it's Shekel Lad. Shekel Lad. It's Slim Shekels. Um, and also, Shekel if you guys lad. are still looking for more Easter gifts and stuff like that, we still have a lot of our little Easter bunny sets, um, our Easter bag. sheep, as well as tons of poly bags of all sorts of sizes. Um, if you guys are looking for something to stuff those Easter baskets with. Look, if anybody wants a Tweety Bird, here we go. Tweety Tweety. Um, let's see. What else we got? Uh, I don't we, know. Got, we got, uh, we got uh, first thing called one. We are looking for ideas for our May Make and Take. If you guys have any ideas, please send that our way. Um, I'm design thinking about a couple of different things, but I'm not sure what's going to be mostly cost efficient. Costs like fifteen bucks. We could, we could go. I guess we could. You know what? I guess we could go Star Wars. Should we? Uh, so I don't know. You guys May think the fours, just of number four with Star Wars <laughs> colors? <laughs> Do you guys uh, <laughs> just made the way four? Just oh, yeah, red versus blue. Um, do you guys do you guys think we should do a uh, yes, do Star Wars themed make yes, and take? I will say it might be a little more expensive than our ten to fifteen dollar range, but but it's Star Wars. You should do People the like no you should what. just do like oh. A, you know what I think we should do? I, I think we should do like a microfighter of a ship that they've never done before. Because we could do that. Yeah, that's that's the, uh, I think that would be something the, that we could probably do for fifteen twenty uh, bucks. Do a vendor. Actually, no. There's already a vendor. What about no, the, there's not. The Nebula B. There's a, there's a microphone editor. Nebula B. Uh, the frigate would be too expensive. Yeah, because it's like a big one. And to make it how, how skinny it is, you can put a minifigure hey, in the back. No, there's no Why would you put a minifigure in the back? You put it towards the front where it's heavier. But there's no space. What do you mean? For how long it's you'd have to make it? Scale. I know. Yeah, but it's, oh, dear. it's a microfighter. Kurt says, Star Wars, I will buy it. Star Wars. Yes, I know. Four studs wide. You could literally make a Star Wars plate that just has a Boba Fett helmet. Use the the brush. We'll, we'll take a look. If you guys have any ideas for a Star Wars make and take, uh, microfighter or something else like that, or a ship that you have not, or tank or whatever, that you haven't seen, Ooh. email us or text us on, or message us on Facebook. You know, it'd be cool. And we will try to, our best to design something. We should make a um, MTT. No, they've already done that. A they didn't make an MTT, they, they a did, There's a microfighter yeah. MTT. Look, I swear to God, there is. It comes okay. with, they, I think there's a droid, a B1 battle droid that drives Listen, it. No, they Listen, made they made a homeless Listen, fighter droid Chris, and they made a vulture droid. Come here, that's young the one. only ones that they made. Ooh, uh, I don't know. That, yeah, so let's let's just right swing now. back over. So they did micro fighter, but you can't put a mini thing in there because it's older. So it's a micro. It's just a micro like, build, not a micro fighter. What the same thing? No, it's not Do you fight with it? The fighters, the, the micro fighters, you put mini, the, the micro fighters, you put many things in. Do you have Star Wars battles with it? <laughs> then buy no, that. I just sit on okay, a shelf. It's a, it's a paperweight. It's a freaking UCS Millennium Falcon is a micro fighter. That's like an expensive micro fighter, but it's a micro. <laughs> fighter. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you for joining us. Make sure you guys check out uh, our future streams and everything else. Thank you for joining us on the Shekel Show. On the Shekel Show, yep. Uh, something Deadpool, Frank said. Something dead. But that has nothing to do with May. Maybe we could do it for a different month. Maybe, maybe there's International Deadpool Day. I don't know. We could we could try to find out what that is. Actually, no. There was Deadpool Day. It was uh, February, I think, because they had a stream for Deadpool's like 30th anniversary. Oh, I don't know. They, they I don't know. Like, May the fourth, we should do a Star Wars make and take. Yeah, uh, some sort. Yes. So we'll see what happens. Um, I think that's. I think that's it. You guys yeah, that's show. Much it. Shekel show. Thank you for All right, guys. Thank thing. you guys for joining us tonight. We appreciate everybody who joined in and claimed some awesome lots today. Shout out to some new people. We are going to be back next week. I think Freddie is going to join us again for both. Are you coming back next week too? If, if, if I'm not fired. Holy cow. And my, if you, my, if you would like to guest host as well, make sure you guys post it or you know, message us so we can guys hook you up. My um, we'll have some fun Freddie's with it. not permanent. He's just what we have now. <laughs> Excuse me, what? <laughs> my, my contract. Your mother can squeeze I haven't, you. I haven't signed a contract yet, which means I'm yes. on for the long run. Check, check you're here, here for instead. free. And I don't, I get you're a, here. Get a, all right, fellas. All right. Um, I'm not giving you the t-shirt. Also, make sure you, if you guys are not signed up with our email address or uh, our email program, make sure you guys sign up. Uh, we do send out uh, frequent emails about events coming up. Uh, we are also offering some classes this summer. Um, finally. Uh, which is going to be our stop motion animation class. Uh, we're starting a new digital design class using BrickLink's Studio software, uh, which is going to require you to have. Dave's getting tired. Yeah. 
which is going to require you to get uh, a iPad, a device, tablet, or a computer of your own um, to do it. It is. It's awesome. Um, so we're going to be teaching that. We're going to be doing an intermediate, a sorry, an introductory, an intermediate, and an advanced class. Um, hopefully, all over the summer, get it done. Uh, we got our stop motion animation class coming up. We're doing our our uh, building basics class again for anybody who's getting new into building Lego. And uh, I've got some stuff in the works for some special interviews and maybe some other events with some friends from Lego Masters. And, uh, very, so very soon, probably next month, I may be starting a, a YouTube channel. So if you care, which you probably don't, uh, check me out. I don't I don't have one yet, so obviously. You <laughs> do you follow him later? Check out check out David's streams that we did this week and probably will do next week and that we did last. But check out all of them. Okay, just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Do, do it. it. Do it. Do it. Rage right. with us. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for uh, watching the show. Make sure you guys tune in next week, 7.30 Central Time. Once again, uh, thank you, Freddie, for joining us. Check and, uh, night, yeah, guys. that's pretty thank much you. it. All right, guys. Have a good night. We're out of here. Awesome.